What's up, you guys? Hey, everyone. Welcome back to Jared and Britt today. You guys, we are so excited. From the title of this video, you will have seen that we are doing an amazing giveaway of <laughs> Three cruises. That's right, guys. Three cruises. One here on YouTube, one over on Instagram, and one on TikTok. We went over all the details about it in yesterday's video. So if you are new here and you have no idea what's going on, make sure you go back and watch our last video. We explained everything. But the short version is we just wanted to say thank you to all of our amazing YouTube family, all of our communities across all social platforms. We live here in Fort Lauderdale. We absolutely love cruising. And also, I have to say, this is in no way sponsored. This nope. It's a giveaway just from Jared and myself as a way, as I said, to say thank you to all of you. So this is the video we were referring to. This is our special cruise movie. And all you need to do to enter is to make sure you are subscribed to Jared and Britt. You need to like this video and comment down below what your favorite port was that we went to and also why you want to go on a cruise. Please also read the description of this video to read over all the rules of the giveaway. You'll also find there a link to our Instagram and TikTok where we are giving away a cruise on each of those as well with all the details on those platforms. So without further ado, you guys, grab your popcorn, sit back, relax, enjoy the movie, and good luck. What's up, you guys? Hey, everyone. Welcome back to our channel Woo! today. It's cruise day. It's cruise are so excited, so pumped. We're so giddy. All packed already. It was a bit of a late night last yeah, night. It was. Everything into our suitcase. <laughs> Speaking of that, if you missed yesterday's video, make sure you go back and watch yes. it. We show everything we are bringing on the cruise, you guys. guys. My suitcase is literally packed to the gills. There's like It's part. like about to like break apart. But we got everything we are going to need and we cannot wait to get out there. <laughs> now the hardest part comes. Oh man. Our little Finn. Oh, no, little Finn. It kind of knows what's going on. He told he totally knows. Brittany had a genius idea though to take our suitcases outside in the hall. When she was walking them earlier, I did that, so Finn doesn't really know. Yeah, so he's not gonna see us like leave. Yeah. Him. Finn's probably thinking, dude, I know what's going on. Oh, yeah. You can't fool me. Exactly what's going on. <laughs> Duke's here, his mom is coming to pick them up, Carissa. She's gonna be taking care of this little guy, <laughs> so he'll be in awesome hands. Our suitcases are packed, as Jared mentioned, out in the hall. Now we gotta grab an Uber and head to Miami. moment for a little bit so we gave ourselves an hour to get to Miami which usually takes about 40 minutes so we gave ourselves like an extra 20 minute buffer time and we had to be there between 2 and 2 30 p.m. in order to like check in that was our check-in that time. was our check-in time there was an accident we just passed it so now we are moving again we were really getting stressed out because now it is 2 30 right now the accident was so bad yeah so bad it involved four cars all yeah. smashed up and it was in the express lane which is the lane we were in yeah and so we were just like pinned in there we couldn't get out our hearts were kind of racing i called royal caribbean talked to an emergency travel line yeah. they have for their passengers which is really nice and i explained she said oh you guys should be okay you don't leave until around four it's definitely nerve-wracking because like we are supposed to be technically be done by now fingers crushed you guys we make it to the port and we make it on the cruise Not a lot of people around because pretty much everyone's on the ship. Yeah, I'm a little nervous that we will still be at the game. We're about to check in, but we just made it to the port. We'll see you guys hopefully soon on the ship. First step of vacation starts oh now, baby. My gosh, <laughs> Right Look at this. Oh my gosh, the exposure is totally over the top, bud. Right Look at here. that. Look, that is the water. I'm looking straight on the ship right now. That is so cool. Oh down. my gosh, we're going on vacation and I can hardly wait. We're gonna eat so much and gain a lot of weight. We were laughing so hard because once we realized we were probably okay, for a second we were really panicking yeah. in the car because we were in the car for over two hours. Two so hours. It's, it's only 40 minutes away. We're in there for two hours. Anyways, you're kind of panicking. I just envisioned us running down the like dock. Yeah, the jetway. I know. I know. Speaking anyway. of running, look at this. 
I need to just run straight to our room. This looks amazing. Okay. Oh yeah, say hello everyone. Woohoo! Hey, this is it. We're on. What? <laughs> guys, this is incredible. <laughs> Welcome to the cruise, everyone. I hope you guys are ready to have some fun. Heck yeah, baby. We are in the official promenade right now. Stoked as can be. Yeah, it's just beyond incredibly beautiful out here. So now we have to go to the mustard deck in order to get our cruise passes and do a safety briefing. Guys, we're getting so giddy right now. This is just amazing. Yeah, they, we just finished our safety <laughs> checking. Went awesome. We haven't made it to our room yet. Yeah. Like, we getting sidetracked. <laughs> this is incredible. Look at this. Look at this. This is like right just outside of like our floor. This is called Wonderland. You guys look at the gardens back here. Oh, oh yeah. My. Oh my. This is a this Wonderland. Is, this is one of the specialty, I think. Oh really? Yeah. It looks so cool. Definitely very grateful for all these maps right here because every single level looks the exact same. You definitely get it's lost. It's so pretty. Everything's like lit with lights. Like, I'll tell you I'm what, if this away. boat sinks, you better let me hang out on that door the with you. This ship is beautiful. <laughs> she didn't get that. I'm laughing because the ceilings in this hallway, look at Jared's head. It, he almost touches it. Yeah. Really <laughs> I mean, we're tall, but this is kind of funny. Okay. Ooh. Ooh, we made it to our room. This is us right here. Oh my God. Holy Welcome cow. On board. This is going to be awesome, you guys. This is awesome. Look at that. Our Bingham. little cards. All right, baby, you ready to see our stateroom for the next week? Heck yeah. <laughs> <gasps> wow! <laughs> no way! Oh, that is amazing! My oh goodness, my gosh! This is so cute. Oh my gosh, guys! Look at this! Babe. Look at this! We have so much more space than our first time ever. Before. Yeah, this is a total this game is... changer. Any of you that don't know, the first cruise, the only cruise I've ever been on, and the first cruise we went on was on our honeymoon. So it's so nostalgic <laughs> being back here. We did have an interior room. Yeah, which means they had no windows of any kind, and it was so small and so tight that we would probably be at the end of the room right now. But yeah. now we got like a little bit bigger room, and it has a balcony. We've never done anything like this before. I've never done anything like this. Before. Yeah, Jared's been on so many cruises and he's yeah. never had one with the balcony. So this is gonna be an <laughs> awesome first. Guys, we're so excited. I'm looking at the ocean right now from our room. This yes, is so cool. Cool. We, this. we gotta give you a tour right now. Oh my god. Check this out. There's just so much more space. We had a little gander around. Okay, first of all, you were getting so much natural light from the balcony. We'll I know. Get that we'll get to that in a second. So should we start with the restroom? Yes. Yes, please. I'm very impressed with the size yes. of this restroom. The size of this restroom nice is. is so much bigger than our first cruise ever. Let me ever. just give you a comparison, Jared. Come on in here. <laughs> we can fit both of us in here. Do you remember the first one? Like we can barely yeah. like turn. But I now know. two people can for sure fit in here. You got storage, which is awesome. I'm definitely gonna put up my magnet hook and hang. <laughs> oh, they have hangers right here. Yeah. I can my makeup bag there. That's super convenient and nice. Nice shower. That's I a good love size. that. Look at inside of there. Just, hey guys. Woo -hoo. It amazes me that they can fit so much in a small space. I love the temperature thing right there. Yeah, that way you can set it to cold or hot. You guys, huge huge closet. closet. Look at the size Look of that, that closet. That is massive. And now we're not massive. in any kind of suite or anything. It's just an no. outside stateroom balcony. Which quick tip, if any of you guys are going on a Royal Caribbean cruise, make sure that you pick the balcony that you want to be on because if not, you could actually get an interior balcony. Yes. Which means it overlooks Central Park, the which interior of the ship. Which is still awesome. Which is still very cool, but if you're thinking that you're going to get a view of the ocean, yep. you're not. That's a good point yeah. right there, yeah. Jared. <laughs> so then you walk in here, you have an awesome little desk, which is going to be awesome for you. Oh, heck yeah. I'm going to be all the vlogs are gonna be edited right there, baby. Fingers crossed Wi Fi. I know, I know. <laughs> see how that goes. This is awesome. Like, yeah, right this is super cool. nice. And then another. Closet. Oh my gosh, Brittany's this, second closet. Got a, <laughs> has my suitcase. Look, we can put our shoes yeah, in. Yeah, that actually here. is mega drawers. convenient. I love how much space there is. We got the two extra drawers there, yeah. There's a mini fridge in oh, here. Oh, I do like that. Lots of drawer space. Tons of drawer space. Now come over into the bedroom. You can see how beautiful. Look how big that is. Oh. I am so glad. Oh, no, no, no. Hold on. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm trying to block the amazing view. Oh my gosh. Wake up to the ocean. I know. I know. It's absolutely incredible. Look at the size of this bed. Like I said, I have been on a few cruises myself. The rooms are never this big. And so I just feel so giddy and so happy because I've never done this before. Brittany's obviously never done this before. So I'm just so grateful and happy that we're able to do this and share it with all of you guys as well. But guys, this is the most exciting part right here. Oh my gosh. Right now. This is so incredible. We yeah. have not gone out 
on the balcony yet. I'm Here we go, ahead. baby. Oh, oh my oh. goodness. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> Holy cow. Oh, oh my, my gosh. gosh. Here, Guys, the Miami this right is insane. I mean, look at that. I'm looking at the Miami like skyline, Miami Bay. I was a little bummed we weren't going right out of Fort Lauderdale. <laughs> I know. This is so beautiful. This place. is gorgeous. Here in Miami. Wow. All right, guys. Well, we are gonna sit down in these one of these lovely <laughs> chairs. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Take it for a little bit. Oh so my gosh. And then we will see you for our away. <laughs> very far. Uh, you want to know why? Because we looked just out this way and saw that. Hello. Look at that. That is another cruise right ship. Look at this. That thing is actually going pretty quick. Look at that. This was the Carnival Horizon. Yeah, this one looks awesome. Look at the size of that thing. That thing is massive. Oh my gosh. And it's coming right here. I'd actually be curious if any of you guys have been on Carnival Horizon before. Let us know. I've always wanted to do a Carnival with Brittany. There's a party going on. <laughs> There's definitely a party going on. Oh my goodness. This is dope. We're going to wave to the people. We're going to wave to the people. This is dope. Make sure you guys are following us over on Instagram at Jared and Bridge. We are going to capture everything. Well, this is a first for me. I am holding the camera out over the ocean right now. This is a little freaky, just kind of like looking down, especially with me, the shaky hands, McGee. Wow, look at that, look you at guys, that. I think we have to open up our vlog out here as much as possible. Yeah, this is amazing. Can you imagine sunsets, sunrises, like, oh my gosh. <laughs> just as bad as you, just as bad as you. Whoa, we're moving, baby. We're moving. <laughs> So you guys are gonna have to watch really carefully because we are moving, although it doesn't look like we're moving. <laughs> yeah, no one's looking. <laughs> Goodbye, Miami. This is so funny. No one's looking. We passed another cruise ship because that was so fun having them go. I know that was actually a lot of fun. This is absolutely stunning. The sun is starting to set a little bit. We're looking at the sun everywhere. All right, you guys don't want to see me. You don't want to see this view. You, you want to see this view. view. <laughs> oh my gosh, that is so cool. I will say it's a Saturday here in Miami. There are yachts galore out in Miami Bay. Everyone's just hanging out, having a good time. I am so happy that our stateroom is on this side. Yeah, so fun leaving port like this. We were gonna go up to the roof. That's like where all the party is and everything. Yeah. But this is so cool. Oh, I know. Beautiful view. I know. I actually think this view is better. I really do. There we go. We got someone right there. Thank you. We'll see you guys. Woo! Dang, we are really moving now. I know the wind's in our hair. <laughs> Ocean. This is so cool. Land behind. Land behind. <laughs> there are cars honking like crazy right now. Everyone just waving to the cruise ship, saying bye. This is dope. And this is awesome. Miami is in the background right here. We have another cruise ship coming out behind us. I know, that is so cool. The boat way back there in the distance. We have basically just been enjoying this balcony view for like the last two hours. 
So. I think our vacation is made. Like, I we don't know. need to do anything else. This has been awesome. I think, though, now we're getting pretty hungry, so we're going to go get something to eat and go explore the ship. Okay, you guys, it is late. It's like one in the morning. Yeah, it's like 1.30. <laughs> Jared has already started editing a little bit. So tonight we wanted to go explore the ships for ourselves a little bit before we take you guys all around. And yes. oh my gosh, there is so much to show you. So <laughs> make sure you come back tomorrow. We are gonna close out the vlog tonight get to sleep in the morning we are gonna wake up in the bahamas heck yeah crazy. baby there's gonna be so oh, much oh we see. are so stoked so if you guys are not subscribed definitely hit that subscribe button right yes. now and also make sure you're following us over on tiktok and instagram i have been making a lot of tiktoks and reels that i think you guys will really <laughs> enjoy get some rest we will see you all tomorrow see you guys love you bye, bye. Just reached its first destination. Look at this. <laughs> this thing is so <laughs> big. It's it so is crazy. massive. Look, Look at the size of that thing. Oh my gosh. We have just arrived in the Bahamas. Heck yeah, baby. We're here at Perfect Day at Coco Cay. So, this is a private island that Royal Caribbean owns, and it's just for cruise ships. Which is awesome. Yeah. So, I mean, look how fun that looks. The water, you guys, is sparkling. <laughs> oh my gosh, we've already seen so many fish just walking along I the know, docks. I we know. cannot wait just to get in there and explore. Ready. It looks so freaking rad. Awesome look at this. Kids. I mean, look over here as well. This is gonna be so much fun. There's so many different things you can do. Excursions, there's water parks. If you wanna keep it chill, come to Chill Island. That's where we're going. Heck yeah, baby. We, brought we even our brought our snorkel yeah, gear. We're we gonna jump stuff. in there for sure. We saw fish all around here, especially over there. So I think we're definitely gonna get in there and hopefully have some awesome snorkeling. I just saw zip liners go. Oh my god. So as I mentioned, you can pay to do different things. So like the water park, zip line, different things like that. They are pricey. So we decided, you know what? For today, instead of doing an excursion, we are gonna bring our snorkel stuff, chill at the beach, walk around, and explore the island. A few little tips for you guys. If you are coming to Coco Cay, they do allow pool towel rentals here. Mm -hmm. We're a little worried because all over on the app and everything it says bring a towel from the ship, but they do have towel stands around. You do have to check them back in or else you are charged to make sure you return them. So we grabbed our towels, but on our way over to the store clean, we did pass the chill grill. <laughs> Guys, they have so much stuff. Burgers, hot dogs, sandwiches, chicken, oh, what else? Just I've just gone to fruit, town. Anything you can pick up and it's all free, which is really nice. Cause there are a few clubs they try and sell you on for, I think it's around like $200 a person for the day. And it does include food, it Crazy says expense. private beach, but like there's so many beautiful beaches. Mm -hmm. This whole thing is packed with food, delicious food. Yeah. We just had our first soft serves of many of the trip. We're gonna finish up some lunch and then we are gonna hit beautiful blue water. Tip when you guys arrive at your port, make sure you talk to a local about where the best spots for snorkeling is. Just found out it's actually here at Chill Island, 
where there's a sunken ship. <gasps> So cool. <laughs> yeah, this is gonna be pretty dope. The water here is pristine. It looks very similar to Alligator Reef. Oh my gosh, yeah. it's beautiful. It's gonna be awesome. And also, you guys, they have beach chairs everywhere. You can hang out, yeah. relax in. Like, this is awesome. <laughs> Question for you, if the early bird gets the worm, what does the person who arrives later get? Front row Joe, Front baby. Row Joe. <laughs> there's actually a ton of chairs here. Like, I know, there's, no there's need so many. To, like rush here whatsoever. <laughs> Look how beautiful this is. I know, this is like our own little private beach. It's like taping it in. So beautiful. Over there I see the cruise ship, the little inlet where you can snorkel, the beautiful water. Oh, this is paradise. One big huge tip, bring your own snorkel gear. Everyone here is kind of looking for something to do because the snorkel gear is expensive. Yeah, you can rent it, <laughs> but we invested in this. We bring it on all of our tropical trips. Well, I mean, we live in Florida, so we use yeah. it too. Oh, oh, this water feels nice. It's a little chilly, surprisingly. Ooh, it's refreshing. It is refreshing. Hot yeah, day. it's very hot, especially with that white, gorgeous sand. Wow. All right. Time to go find this shipwreck. This is dope with that cruise ship in the background like that. Look at that. We just finished up with snorkeling and we had an absolute blast. I will say this, quick little tip. You might wanna go where people are not because there's so many people, they're kicking up the sand and within the water, which makes it a little bit murky. Now I will say this, the snorkeling wasn't as good as like alligator reef or anything like that just because there's no reef for the most part. It's mostly just a bunch of sand and they did have that one sunken piece of the ship, which was really cool to see. But if you're expecting like really epic snorkeling here at Coco Cay, you're not gonna really get it, at least here at Chill Beach. I will say this, I brought in a little tiny bit of food from the buffet and I let it go underneath the water and the fish went crazy. That was really cool. I do wanna show you guys this though. I mean, look at the boat over there. That thing is huge. Oh my gosh, I absolutely love it. So this is where we've gone snorkeling, guys. We went all throughout here. We went way out there and then all throughout this bay right here. Luckily, it's fairly shallow and so you're able to like swim out there and then if you get a little bit tired, you can actually just kind of stand up and wait. But I do love, they have like these little platforms set up. You can kind of see them behind me and you can sunbathe on top of them. You can rest, you can jump off. We saw a lot of people doing that, which was really cool. Right back here behind me, they have shops galore, all these like local shops, like souvenir shops. So guys, this island is insane. We literally took the drone up and it is so beautiful. It is so cool. The water is like turquoise blue. We absolutely love it here. Oh, we got the cutest girl if there ever was. Oh my gosh, you guys, oh, oh. heaven. I know, this is seriously pure I heaven. I almost fell asleep for a little bit after snorkeling, <laughs> but literally just looking at, the, I love seeing all the clouds right in front of her. I don't know if you, when Jared is out there talking, you notice the clouds behind him, but they are so beautiful. Oh, from here. the drone footage, you guys will definitely notice it. A lot of people are starting to head back to the boat. Now we have a couple more hours you can stay out here. Mm -hmm. I think we might go try and walk around a little bit more of the island, maybe stop by the food again. Yes. They have to offer, but it's been <laughs> incredible. I would say if you have kids especially, like this is like a little paradise. Oh, the seriously. The waves are so calm, it's shallow, like perfect. There's so many little kids that are just building sand castles. And Making friends with each other too. Yeah. So some hacks we're thinking of for next time we come back here, <laughs> definitely coming back here, is we'll probably bring our inflatable pool yes. tubes that roll up. Probably gonna bring those on our next one because the Caribbean is usually so calm, you can just float out there, uh -huh. that way you don't have to rent them, and they pack up really easy. They just inflate and deflate. Yeah, you guys will probably see they offer like these blue mats behind me, but that, in addition to the snorkel gear, it can get really, really expensive. Also, if you guys watched our packing video, you saw that I mentioned I bring detangler, and then I also brought a little water bottle. And so my hair gets so snarly after snorkeling with all the seawater and everything. So I brought that and then a little wet brush and I just brushed it out. It's all nice and smooth now yeah. and ready to go. So there's my little hack too. And who pointed that out? Jared. Yeah, I did. Yes. After watching the video. Okay, 
Okay, so we're on our way to go return the towels, and this is what we wanted to show you guys about the local little shops here. Here, there are all these like little like huts, as you guys can see, packed to the gills of just nothing but souvenirs. So cute. <laughs> in case you're wondering, why is Brittany holding everything? Well, it's because I'm vlogging, baby. <laughs> One of the advantages of being the cameraman is that you gotta have the hands free so you can talk and point. I didn't know Sherpas were all the way out here in the Bahamas. Pretty impressive. Here are some of the products that they're selling. They all say Coco K Bahamas. That one is just shirts. This one over here looks like hats and bags. This one has Coco K Bahamas with backpacks, tank tops, toys. Even got some glasses in here. Some really cool dresses and blouses. Souvenir jewelry. They definitely offer a ton of really cool stuff that I think we're gonna have to go check out. Okay, so earlier from our vlog, we stood out on this bridge right here and showed you guys this amazing like Lagoon Bay area with the zip line that goes across it. I flew the drone over it as well and it's so pretty. It's so cool, man, guys. I'm just giddy right now. It's so cool. This thing is awesome. It's super helpful. It's basically the directions of where everything is out here in the park. As you guys can see, they have so many things to offer. Speaking of which, a super hot mamacita. Towels. Oh, thank you, Sherpa. I That's think very nice of you. Go back over to the food, get some. <laughs> oh, yeah. Before we head back to the ship. Also, you guys, there's pools and tons of other things around here we have not even seen yet. So, yeah. we're going to go walk around, kind of explore a little bit. So, guys, they got juices, they got ice cream. They have a bar right here. They have all sorts of assorted fruits, as you guys can see. They have the salads here, the burgers, hot dogs. Now, it does look like they've actually closed at 3 p.m. and it's like 3.15, so it looks like we're not eating anything right now. <laughs> I know, lots of fresh fruit. And there's always room for ice cream. Jared found his favorite spot. Look, <laughs> look how awesome this is. They just got a hammock right here. Oh my gosh. I see Jared here and I looked between the trees. I see this massive water slide. We were just talking about Jared would love that. Yes. We didn't pay for that excursion Isn't to go into that part. This is seriously so much fun. It's awesome. It. <laughs> so we are probably one of the last ones on the island right now. Yeah. It is definitely, definitely clearing out. Oh my gosh, there's tons of hammocks over there. Oh. Gosh. There's a whole place where there's just hammocks of where you can go lay in. I know, I definitely want to come back here. This is awesome. Walkway back to the cruise. This is seriously so cool. Look what's behind me. This yeah. massive boat, the beautiful turquoise waters. Like you can't get better. It's so fun. Wow. Coco K, you were uh, on our favorite list. You did not day. disappoint, baby. Hey! We're pushing off! We're pushing off! Check it out, guys! Oh, it goes so slow, but it it's does go crazy. really slow. It's kind of like a silent little killer there. We gotta wave goodbye to the Bahamas. I know. Guys. Bye, Bahamas! Actually, that's the end of the Bahamas. That's the wrong way, yep. Yeah. Alright, Phil. This way, yeah. Bye, Bahamas! <laughs> so, last time we vlogged you guys, we were just leaving Coco Cay, which mm -hmm. was so so much fun. Oh, it was a blast. Fun is an understatement. It was awesome. It was. It was really, really seriously cool. so much fun. Like we said this earlier, but it's just so awesome. It's such an easy place to be because oh, you yeah. just go there and you know there's gonna you're gonna be taken care of. You don't have to plan it a whole ton if you don't want to. 
there's definitely places you can reserve and go into. Yeah. We did see there is a huge pool. I think that's open to everyone. And then they have the little private beach clubs and things like that you can pay for. But we had an awesome time and it was all free for us. Yeah, so. it was wonderful. We are though getting quite a few questions both here on YouTube and over on Instagram. Just asking about a ton of details like how do you reserve dining? Kind of all cruise related questions. Mm -hmm. So I think it might be really helpful. Why don't you drop your comments here if you have any other yeah, ones. Yeah, yeah. We'll go through them and then during this week or after the cruise we will yeah, try and really do cool. like a Q&A, Q, do them all together and it's try to draw your questions. It just doesn't get old, sorry. It's I was so listening fun. to Brett, but this view just doesn't get old. I just love that. You know, I love it doesn't it. get old? This view right oh, here. Doesn't he look so sad, handsome? Awesome. <laughs> Ooh, I love Jared and Blue. It's like my favorite color on him. Favorite, favorite. Oh, you're going to be handsome. <laughs> yes. It is our anniversary trip, guys. Yeah, guys. Oh my gosh, I just can't get over this. It is so blue, so beautiful. Look at the clouds right here. And you can actually see a cruise ship way off in the distance over there. Yeah, so that is something Jared actually taught me, that cruise ships kind of travel in packs. So they're just far enough away that you, you're not like in each other's space. Yeah. But they're close enough by if something goes wrong. Yeah. Ship yeah, nearby, super which nice. Brings so much comfort, especially <laughs> anybody that might have like a fear of being out in the middle of the ocean. Exactly. Now, you guys, we just got all showered and dressed, and we are going to go to dinner. Hot diggity dog. So our dinner reservation every night is at 8 p.m. We got one of the later ones. Yeah. We will go through kind of how dining works and everything in that QA. But yeah, dinner reservation tonight at 8. We cannot wait. We are starving. <laughs> yes. I mean, how do we starve? We've been eating all day. <laughs> but for now, you guys, we're just going to sit back, relax, and take I thought this was seafood pasta. I read it wrong. <laughs> looks like we just got some French onion soup. This looks divine. Look at that cheese melted right over the top. Ooh, lolly. Brittany is just enjoying that little pasta pastry I thought it was, but it's not. <laughs> Time to take the spoon and dive right on in. Oh, this is my favorite part about cruise ships, being able to try so many different things. And for my entree, I got a steak. Take a look at this bad boy, that looks good. Curious, how do you guys like your steak? Do you like it medium, well done, or medium rare? And bread, oh, what do we get in here? Huh? I got the grilled chicken. Nice. Went a little more simple tonight. I like it, I like it. <laughs> All right, for dessert, you guys, I got Bananas Foster. Jared got the apple tart. I got this last night and it was so good. Look at the sugar crystal crust with ice cream. I might need to order another one. Sorry, babe, this is the last I, one. I just told Jared <laughs> I woke up this morning thinking about that apple pie right there. Really did. I really did. Really did. <laughs> okay, guys, we just finished up with dinner. It was seriously so good. I could eat like 20 of those like apple pie thingies. They are delicious. We'll explain how all the dining works in our Q&A coming up. <laughs> we just walked out and we're on the main promenade right now. Yeah, this thing is awesome. Just take a look at all this. I mean, it's just beautiful every which way you look. So tomorrow's our first sea day. So you're going to be on the ship all day. So we're planning to just take you guys yeah. all around. Show you all the ins and outs about the ship. So stay tuned for I that. I know, it's gonna be a ton of fun. This place is just wows me every single time I walk down it. It's just huge. Look how much room there is. I can't believe we're on a boat right now. Yeah, it's great. You don't feel like you're in a boat, you feel like you're in a huge hotel. <laughs> we were down walking back to the room and Britt just pointed out, look how far back that hallway goes. You can't even see the end of it. You can't even see the end. And the same is true right in front of us. Look this way. <laughs> look at that. It just goes. It, it just goes, goes and goes. I mean, this one's a little bit more within reach. I mean, you I, can kind of see the end there. I kind of want to time it how long it would take to run the whole thing. <laughs> you want to do it? You can do it. You want to see Britt do it. I yeah, want to see. Let, let me know if you want to see. 
get from that end to one chip to the other end. Yeah, that one I legitimately cannot see the end. Yeah. I have no idea. We just got back to our room to a fun little surprise. So look how darling. This is one of the fun parts about when you come back to your stateroom. Look at this towel with the little sunglasses. She actually used a pair of my sunglasses to create it. Isn't that so That's cute? That's awesome. That's super cute. That's cool. We have the nicest lady um, assisting us with our room. Her name is Penny. Yeah. She is darling. We just talked to our waiter at dinner. You have the same waiter at dinner every night, which is so fun so you can really get to know them. And our waiter's name is Edwin and he is Awesome. He was he's telling so us cool. he's worked for Royal Caribbean for 10 years. Yeah. He's been doing this, which is so cool. He's from Honduras, and yes. one of our stops, as you guys know, is Honduras. It's Honduras. So we've yeah. been talking to him a little bit. Anyways, they are just the sweetest people ever. They work so, so hard. hard. They work for 10 hours a day, every single day. And a lot of them are on contracts from like seven to eight months. So they're yeah. here working seven to eight months, and then they get, I think, a couple months vacation, yeah. and then they come back and do it again. Good for them. So, man, anyways, they're incredible. Sweetest people around. I have been so impressed with Royal Caribbean. Yeah. Just their treatment, their staff, like, it's top notch. All right, you guys. Well, I think we are going to call it a night tonight. The sun took us out of us. I know, we were exhausted. exhausted. We were falling asleep. We were just talking. It's only day two. This was yeah. technically, like, our first real day. Yeah, and it was awesome. And it was so much fun. incredible. Thank you so much for all the love this week comments we're so glad you guys are enjoying this cruise we love sharing it with all of you so until tomorrow we will see you later see you guys love you bye Look at this view. <laughs> I mean, how can you go wrong starting every morning? You literally open your eyes, look to the side, and you see this. How I know, it's you... just incredible. It's just breathtaking. <laughs> it literally is. We slept with the door open last night. We really here. did. The beautiful waves, the wind. It's just so, like, this is what makes a cruise a cruise. So today is our at sea day, meaning we spend the whole day on the ship, which we are so excited about because we feel like we haven't even gotten to see half of the ship yet. Yeah. We are going to first start with breakfast. Just sat down for breakfast, and I think I think we may have one of the best seats in the house. Look at this. We're right in the middle of the ship, Symphony of the Seas. You can overlook all of the balconies. Oh, there's a zip line right here. See this person going across? We're gonna for sure do that. We can't wait to show you the upper decks here, but first let's just start with breakfast. <laughs> yeah. All right, they have everything here. We got French toast, waffles, pancakes, cinnamon rolls, eggs, sausage, bacon, hash brown, avocado toast. This is yes, the best looking please. avocado toast I've ever seen. They have fruit parfaits, they have rice, they have pretty much anything you can think of. Breakfast is served, I think it's 7.30 to 11, and then lunch starts right after that. Goes from like 11 to 2, mm -hmm. I want to say. So we are eating up at the Windjammer. It's a buffet. They have a ton of protocols in place right now. You wash your hands before you come in. Yeah, Everything's like sanitized. It. Tables even have a little sticker that says clean and ready for you to enjoy, which is great. This is awesome. <laughs> this is what better way to start the day? Also, you guys, if you are curious, this is all included. This whole buffet is included free of charge with your purchase of the cruise, Best thing ever. which is awesome. <laughs> Dinner or dinner. We just finished up with breakfast. With breakfast? Oh my gosh, you guys, it was amazing. So it's delicious. So, so now we are gonna walk the ship a little bit. And we thought for today's video we wanted to share the ship with you because there's so many fun things to do, to see. Right now we are yeah, right in front of us is something called Central Park. Overlooking Central Park. So it's the middle of the ship. They literally have created a park, there's restaurants, walkways, there is a cafe over there that's included with your fair cruise, which yeah, is awesome. Yeah, right here. So we'll walk down there in a little bit. Wherever you are, if you just look over this way, you see all the open elevators. They have some really cool art pieces over here. It's just the whole experience is awesome. And just like that, we made it to the pool. <laughs> 
Perfect, you guys. We're heading over to the fitness center. There's also a track that goes around the whole ship. I think yeah. we're gonna walk around. But as you can hear, there's music playing, people everywhere. It's so much fun, just oh, the yeah. vibe of a cruise ship. Vibe here is so cool. There's so many things to do here, it's awesome. Some pools over here. On the other side, we have a kids' whole center for play. There's water slides. Deck chairs galore. <laughs> Guys, look how beautiful it's and epic so this looks. It's so freaking cool. That's where we ate at earlier. So this is like the buffet area, which is awesome. This is amazing though. Okay, can I just say, we will be back here. Look at these pool chairs. <laughs> the ocean, laying out the sun. Oh, oh amazing. It doesn't get better than that. Britt, if you're ever gonna be looking for me, you can find me right here, baby. Look at this, the tower of power right there. So many awesome slides. These two look almost identical, but that one right there has a clear like tube. That would be so much fun. Check out this pool right here. They got two massive pools. One that you guys saw earlier over here. This one, and then there's a kitty one right here with like a splash pad. So epic. We got hot tubs as well. So question that everyone's asking what? is uh, if you're gonna be racing me down the water slides. Oh, you oh yeah. Okay guys, we are on the other side now of the Central Park. We are just way over there, but check this out. It goes all the way through the ship, as you guys can tell, and each elevator is just the coolest experience. All different types of artwork. Man, this is cool. So we just came to one of the specialty restaurants. This is called the Hook Seafood. A lot of you guys have been asking, is the food included? So there's certain food that's included. It's called main dining, but there are some specialty restaurants that you can pay for just like any other restaurant if you want to have some different experiences you could say so i think there's around six or seven on this ship and this one looks awesome are you ready for a stroll to central park oh. not talking about new york we're in the ocean <laughs> that's right central park here on symphony of the seas incredible this is sick look at this like, that is just insane they got benches they got restaurants it's just, it's <laughs> awesome. Just an audio track playing over they and over sound again. So real, though. <laughs> it really does sound so real. Guys, look at this. This is a boat. This is inside of a boat right now. We're inside of this like, so cool. glass thing I love with it. chairs all around. It's so cool. This it is, is so dope. Awesome. Look at that. So there's the park cafe here, and there's yeah. an Italian restaurant, there's another restaurant called Vintage over here. <laughs> As you can see so too, fun. there's balcony rooms that overlook yeah. the park. That would be really awesome. Yeah, this would be really fun to have like kind of like a balcony room that overlooks the park. Okay guys, so we got the park cafe over there. We got another little bar right here. We have more walkways that you can kind of go down and just stroll through. We got Chops Grill like over here. Chops Grill, that does so, sound very So this is a specialty restaurant. We may have to check one of these out. I, I want to come back and see Park Cafe because that's included with the cruise. So I want to kind of see what they offer. So to get from one side of the ship to the other, you can take the deck upstairs that we were on. We overlook the ocean, which is pretty dope. Or you can there go this way. Oh my gosh, birds. there is a bird. <gasps> there are birds. What in the world? There's a bird right here. I was gonna say, or you can take the Central Park route, but look at this, there's an actual real bird. What, there's a glint. Hey, I'm not the crazy one anymore. You know what, Royal Caribbean has gone above and beyond in this artificial reality stuff. Oh it looks God. so realistic. Well, it is, those are real. <laughs> I know it's real. <laughs> They're real birds, you guys. We we're on our way to the fitness center, but I wanted to show you this is an overlook of the promenade. That's like the main shopping area of the ship. Tons of different shops. Things to do, places to see. Look at this cool stairway down here. That goes down to one of the theaters, which is really fun. There's tons of shows on the ship. So we will go definitely go walk around, show you all of that down there. But I thought this was kind of a cool overlook of the whole thing. Speaking of the promenade and the pizza and all the food, it's time to go work off that food here at the fitness. <laughs> Center. They have a fitness center and spa. An awesome thing to you guys, they have hand sanitizer stations everywhere, pretty much at every entrance to wherever you go. I gotta say, this fitness center is bigger than like most gyms fitness centers. This thing is huge. It's absolutely massive in here. They got everything. They got weights, they got treadmills, aerobics. They even have what looks like a ballet bar room, which I'm gonna love to be in a lot. And the views with the treadmills looking out to the water, I mean, 
doesn't get better than that. Just down from the gym is the running track yeah. slash walking track. This is dope. Let's see how we open it. <laughs> so this thing is indoors and outdoors. So it makes it super easy. There's just one way you need to go. All right, baby, this is the starting line right here. How long it takes us to do one loop? I'm gonna time this. Oh, I feel like it's going to take a long time because right here it opens up and that's the ocean, baby. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh, we got ping pong right here. That's dope. Wow. Look at that view. Wow. That's incredible. Air coming in. Yeah. Okay, I feel like this is gonna take forever. Look at that. That is incredible. <laughs> and then you guys might see these yellow things. So these are lifeboats. Yes. And these things are huge. They're very nice as well. So they could fit a ton of people. So I've actually ridden one of these before. It wasn't an emergency situation. It's just because the cruise ship was not able to get close enough to the port. So they had everyone load up into these things, which was ah. a cool experience. And then we rode over to the port, which was really fun. Yeah, they were just walking through. We could see a little piece of land. We believe that's Cuba we are passing right <laughs> yeah. now. And on this side, this is one of the dining rooms. Yes, in fact, this is where we go eat. Hey guys, I keep thinking of the movie The Parent Trap, you know, on the boat when they're eating dinner. Also, we keep saying we wish we were in the dining room instead of on the running track. This 3K is gonna take forever. Look at this. <laughs> Look at this. Oh my gosh. Wow. Wow. You guys, this is the back of the boat. Holy moly. Look at that. Oh my gosh. You're gripping onto this camera like crazy right now, but this is awesome. So cool. <laughs> Look at that view right there. Oh my gosh, it just doesn't get better. Land. Oh my gosh, yes, that's land right there. You can see it. That's Cuba, baby. We can see Cuba from where we are cruising. Workout is completed. Oh, <laughs> that AC feels nice. All right, you guys, we made it to near the front of the ship. This little section is called the solarium. Really relaxing, quiet, way different than over by the pool by <laughs> yeah. where all the music's bumping very and different. everything. There's like, like no that. music over here. It's yeah. very chill. I think this is adults only. <laughs> Okay, so after the gym, we were reading through some of your guys' comments and saw that one of you guys said that there's a secret lookout on deck 14. Well, we're on deck 15 in the solarium right now, and deck 14 is right there. The secret lookout is right over here. Awesome. We're gonna figure out how to get down there, because that looks insane. I think there might be stairs in the solarium down to it, yeah. but we gotta get up there. This is so cool. Oh my gosh, guys, this is the front. This is the very front of the boat. Look at this awesome helipad. Oh my gosh, thank you so much to whoever said this. We're gonna have to look you up and thank you. Awesome. Thank wow, you. this is incredible. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. So that's the secret lookout right there. We're going there next, but wow, this is dope. Open. I know, this is <laughs> so cool. Oh my gosh, here we go, guys. Through the door to the secret dock. Oh my gosh. This is rad. This is super rad. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay guys, we are on the secret lookout dock. Look at oh this. Oh my gosh, the floor wow. is glass. It's glass. Look at that. That is Please so don't break cool. right now. Wow, you can really see how fast we're going you from guys, here. I feel like I'm on <laughs> Don't let go. Never let go <laughs> oh my gosh. Look at that. Like, I guess that's a helicopter pad. Yeah, that's a helipad. This is so cool. as cool as the other one. Yeah, this one awesome. over here actually has like a viewfinder type thing, like binoculars. <gasps> I just saw a fish. A fish jump? I saw like a big, yeah, like a marlin almost. It might be a dolphin. <sighs> dolphin. 
fish? That would be dope. Yeah, that would be really dope. Guys, and this, this is, is unreal. Incredible. Look at this. Look at this view right now. We are actually sitting out over the water. <laughs> we love cruises. Water slides are over there. I have a feeling he'll be gone for a little bit on those. slides right now but I gotta show you there is this little cloud coming in it almost looks like a little storm cloud but it's clear there clear over there but look how pretty that is a ton of you guys have been commenting you've never thought about going on a cruise well I'm telling you you should go on one if you can it is just such a fun way to travel not only are days on the ship so fun but then you land in these amazing places you get to go explore those it has been an absolute dream speaking of a dream yeah. someone just got back <laughs> How was it? It was so much fun. Oh my god. So I tried to capture it for all of you guys, but they said no cameras. Of the three, blue is extremely disorderly. It's like pitch black, tons of twists and turns. Yellow is chill, <laughs> relaxing. And the green is by far the best. Oh it is my so gosh. much fun. There's clear tubes, there's lights on the inside. It's super crazy. Then it opens up into this massive big old bowl. You swirl around. I actually swirled around three times <laughs> before you go down into a little chute. That's Fun. Vacation! You guys, we love it. Cruises are amazing. Come amazing, join us amazing. in Cozumel. This ship never ceases to amaze me how epic and just cool it is. Oh my gosh. I mean, look at this. Look how big it is. So, maybe you are wondering, this is called the Symphony of the Seas. It joins the Oasis of the Seas class, which I think is like Allure of the Seas, Oasis of the Seas, and a couple others. But I'd be curious if any of you guys have actually been on Symphony of the Seas. Definitely let us know down below. Oh my gosh. I mean, just look at this view. Oh my gosh, literally nothing in sight. Just beautiful blue open water. Ah, time to get a drink, baby. Yeah. <laughs> well, here comes Jared. Oh, Diet If you don't do that, they offer like water and lemonade, I believe. For yes, free. for free. Which is definitely totally awesome. Yeah. And at breakfast, you get free juices. At lunch, you get free juices. That sort of thing. Or you could pay per soda as well if you didn't want to buy the entire drink yeah. package. But yeah. anyways, we kind of splurged and got the soda package. I know. It is, if you do buy in advance, they give you like 30% off. So yeah. definitely buy in advance. Our dinner reservation isn't until 8. That was one of our questions is what do you do if your dinner reservation is so late? Well, they have a buffet here with everything. Mm -hmm. And we're going to get a little pre-gaming on this. <laughs>
Well guys, after that late lunch, early dinner, we weren't that hungry, so we just came back to the room. Sunset, we watched that, and now we're looking at the moon right now. This is the coolest thing in the world. I think getting this balcony was the best thing we ever done, because we spend so much time hanging out here, looking at the ocean, watching the sunrise, watching the sunset. It's just beautiful. I mean, look at this, look at that. That's just incredible, and the fact that we can just have the door open, Anyways, today has been awesome from start to finish. There's so many different things that we wanted to show you. We just didn't have time, but we'll make sure to show you guys the rest of the ship, including the promenade shows, stuff like that, and upcoming vlogs. So make sure you guys are subscribed. Tomorrow we get to Cozumel, so we are stoked for that. But tonight, you guys, we're gonna call it. We love you so much. Until next time, we'll see you later. Bye. What's up, you guys? Good morning, everyone. And welcome back to our we guys. are stuck between two Look cruise this. ships right now. This is our cruise ship. This is Symphony of the Seas, and right next to us is Liberty of the Seas. Both of the seas. <laughs> both of the seas, both Royal Caribbean, both massive. Oh my, oh gosh. my Look at god. That. It's like I'm staying between two buildings right now. It's so cool. You guys, we just got to Cozumel, Mexico. Yeah, woo. And we are so excited for today. The last time we were in Mexico was on our honeymoon yes. six years ago. Six years ago. So for this our honeymoon. is gonna be awesome. We have somewhere really special we're headed. We won't tell you till we get there. <laughs> but for now, we're gonna go walk the pier a little bit and we'll see you soon. Okay, it's hard to get very far without showing you guys the grand awesomeness of this very location, this cruise port. We got two Carnival cruise ships over there, right behind me, I apologize that's super windy, but we got two massive Royal Caribbean ships right there. I mean, this place is it's insane. Awesome. We haven't even gotten to Cozumel yet. We're oh still on the like dock. Gosh. I love the little entrance and everything. I know, super here. cool. So the awesome. water is super blue too. This is gonna be fun. this if you guys are looking for a souvenir here in Cozumel it's not gonna be hard to find they are everywhere there are so, so many different kinds so of like souvenirs shops, cool <laughs> just to get off the ship. so if you don't want to go anywhere else you can just sit stay around here all day oh shop. easily easily hang out I mean we were just going through the air conditioned part of it but there are so many different souvenir shops even just look at this view I mean souvenir shops everywhere we got the cruise ships in the background how cool is okay, this I love all the fun colors <laughs> Buildings everywhere. You just automatically feel like you're in Mexico. I know you totally do. It's, it's so, so rad. Fun. So right now we are going to grab a taxi to take us to where we are going. Sancho's Beach Club and it is so sick. It is so awesome. You get beach chairs right on the beach here. There's tables, all you can eat, food, drinks. It's all inclusive, which is awesome. Look at the stuff over there right real quick. Look how cool and epic that looks. That is so awesome. We found here in Cozumel there's a ton of places like this, so just Google search. Oh yeah. Pretty highly rated and it's close by. We are literally on the water. The, the chairs are in the water. And thank goodness for Brittany's towel clips. I mean, if you guys haven't seen our haul, definitely go check it out. These things are a lifesaver. Okay, it's very windy. So sick. Oh my gosh, look at that view right there. We got a virgin pina colada, you guys. <laughs> and we got a lot of them. <laughs> Just got some food from the buffet. We got burgers, hot dogs, fries, all sorts of goodies there. I just ordered some tacos and coconut shrimp that'll be coming. Oh, we gotta get nachos too. I will say this, so if you're looking for like a super adventurous day, I would probably not recommend a beach club. No. <laughs> just like beachfront access, somewhere you can hang out. We do a ton of snorkeling already in Florida, so we decided to come to a place more like this. We may see if we can do some parasailing potentially or oh. just that would be dope. But as you guys can see here, it's an all-inclusive resort, and so they have so many different things to choose from. I mean, look at all of these food options. They got so many. And then on the back, they have tons of different drinks that you can get here, sodas, cocktails. And like Brittany said, you can get it in the Virgin as well, baby. You. Our food 
just came and we thought we had ordered one shrimp, one chicken, and one fish taco, but they all come with three, so we yeah. got quite we a bit. That, so we have a lot of food here. <laughs> but we also got some coconut shrimp. Those Ooh, look that divine. Looks bomb. Look at that. Oh my goodness. So I guess my earlier was the appetizer, yeah. and now this is the name. So there's a buffet line, as yours said, and then we ordered this from the menu. They also have pools you can go to, so we might head over there a little bit. We also want to go walk along this beautiful beach down this way. It looks so private and pretty. Man, you guys, look at that backdrop right there with the chairs in the ocean. We've never done anything like that before. Oh, it's amazing. It's awesome. It's seriously so much fun. I absolutely love it. Look at this water right now. Hey, it's like turquoise blue. I know. The water is absolutely gorgeous. We just keep seeing parasellers, jet skiers, boats. My gosh. There's like everything you can think of here. Like jet skis, parasails, that water park thing. It's like beautiful water. I know Brittany said all this stuff, but it's so cool. And then there's boats galore over here. And the food was pretty good, you guys. The, yeah. the coconut shrimp was divine. Shrimp tacos were really good. Fresh salsa. I mean, you can't really get better They than do that. make a mean hamburger here. They are pretty good. And the pina coladas. Mwah, <laughs> so good. What is it about just drinking an ice cold drink at the beach that's yeah. just amazing? Guys, when Brittany and I met, I told her I like long walks on the beach. <laughs> and I said, me too. <laughs> this is the definition of a long walk on the beach. Yeah, look at this beach right here. We got like endless, just private beach right it's there. Beautiful Very out beautiful. here. Very beautiful. Ooh, the sun's coming out too right now. The sun, the water in our toes. We wish all of you guys could experience this with us right now. I know, it's pretty cool. Uh, so, our thoughts, real quick, on this place. Yes. It's really cool. It's really, really cool. It's a lot of fun. There's good food. We're sitting literally on the beach. Like, that's so cool. We haven't done that since our honeymoon, which yeah. we absolutely love. I will say this. If you guys don't drink, the price is a little steep to get in here. It was $62 a person. Brittany and I don't drink, and so that seems... For like, alcohol, it's like pretty <laughs> steep. And yeah. I thought like everything would be included, but we just found out the water park is $12 extra a person. Yeah. You have to rent towels, you have to pay extra, pretty much everything besides eating, drinks, the beach chairs, pool. That's all included, yeah. which could be awesome. Yeah. Like if that's all you want, definitely come book <laughs> one of these resorts. But the snorkeling and anything else other than that, like if yeah. you want to rent equipment, that's more. So just do your research when yeah. you're booking. I will say this though, my favorite thing so far is literally what we're doing right now, and it's free. Yeah, it's free. <laughs> so there you are, can't go wrong with that. There are some parks around here as well with yeah. like $25 admission fees. Yes. I would probably do that next time just because we're not super huge into the food yeah, and no. all you can eat drinks and things like that. We get that on the boat every day. Yeah, so. exactly. Especially with us coming. Yeah, that's a great point. I think for us, we just saw those cool like water park things and we just assumed with this saying all inclusive that that stuff was included as well. Yeah. But and I, I think mean, we'll probably do it. I don't know. But it's, I mean, it's been really nice. Very chill day. Oh, today, it's been possible. so nice just to sit back and relax. I mean, I know we live in Florida. We live near the beach. We can go to the beach at any time, but be able to come here and just kick back, relax. It's been heaven. Absolute heaven. <laughs> I was really debating on whether or not I was gonna pay the 12 bucks to go on this thing, but you know, I figured 
You know what? When in Rome, oh boy, there's a lot of stones right here. You gotta watch out. I hope it's not this rocky when you jump into the water because it's really, ow. There's like rocks everywhere. Oh my gosh, look at this right now. This looks insanely epic. We got so many like blow up rafts we can stand on, try to hike up on. I am definitely going to the top of this one and that one. I'm gonna be jumping off both. I was hoping that Brittany would join me on this. She chickened out. She said that she would go parasailing with me or jet skiing on a different day. So I'm gonna hold her to that. But for now, I'm gonna go enjoy this. <laughs> So far, so good on this thing. Holy cow. This thing is like mega wobbly, but it's a lot of fun. I'm gonna attempt to go across this thing without falling. Wish me luck. All right, here we go. <laughs> that didn't work. I'm assuming it gets deep here pretty soon because those are big drops. And I'm still standing easily. got Britt over there, she's filming me, she saw me climb up. I'm not gonna lie, I almost slipped off the edge just trying to stand up the way back to her. <laughs> oh, this is kinda high. That is pretty slick, I love it, look at this, oh my gosh. Okay, jumping off in three, two, one. <laughs> Guys, that was awesome. <laughs> I just climbed up to the top of this white one and it's constantly moving back and forth because there's people on the other side of me trying to get up. <laughs> I wanted to stand up and jump off, but I may have to slide down this time and then maybe try to jump again. That is so high up! That's where I was earlier. Look how much lower that is compared to this one. Oh my god. Well, baby, when in Rome. <laughs> 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 you like touch every time you go down. <laughs> okay guys, I'm laughing so hard. I look over, Jared was jumping on the trampoline. I could hear him just giggling, laughing. Look at him dancing. So cute. Oh my gosh, I'm dying. So how was it? It was good. Oh my gosh, I can hear you laughing from clear over there where I was sitting. This was worth every penny. It was only 12 bucks. It was awesome. Babe, I just keep seeing you go down the slide and you were getting a lot of air. Yeah. Like a lot of air. I was jumping, jumped on the slide, slid down. <laughs> So, so many of you have messaged, wrote comments in saying how much you are loving seeing Jared. So happy, oh. smiling. He's like a kid at the candy store. He totally is. So oh my up. gosh. He's just the cutest. Seriously. You guys rock. Thank you. It was a lot of fun. I hope you guys are enjoying it too. Oh my gosh. We're having the best time here. We were just talking about how this is our first vacation alone. We've been yeah. together in the last yep. two years. Last two years. That's crazy. To Every think about. other vacation we've had either people with us or we've been at, at people's houses yep. like yep. family always a family member has been with us or a friend which is crazy to think about i know so this is crazy this time together is has been oh it's been awesome. amazing it's been so Looking for a Mr. Sandal right now. So one of Jared's sandals got swept away by the water. We cannot find it, so he only has one and currently is shoeless right now. <laughs> hopefully I can just get on board the ship. <laughs> yeah, hopefully they let you on without him. I have an extra pair of sandals on board the ship, so luckily I got that. But yeah, I don't have any more shoes. <laughs> but you guys, the sun came out. It is absolutely beautiful. It just lit up the beautiful water. And now we are just walking through. They have a ton of little shops with vendors. Look at all this fun stuff through oh, here. It's amazing. So we just picked up some vanilla. Yeah. I heard this stuff is amazing. So the sweet lady that does our room, 
Her name is Penny. She is awesome. She's awesome. We asked her, is there anything we can get you from Cozumel? She said the clear vanilla. The clear Mexican vanilla. She said she loves yeah. to bake with it. And so Jared got her the Penny, biggest. Penny, we're coming. Jared got her the biggest <laughs> bottle possible, yeah. which is so sweet. So we're just wrapping up here. This is such a fun little area though. If you do come here, make sure you stop by all the cute little shops. Cozumel, you've been good to us. We had a blast wow. here. Seriously, so much fun. Going day. home sandalless. <laughs> you guys, the line to get on the ship sandals. was so long. And they oh, were I nice know. and let Jared kind of go to the front because he had no shoes. He couldn't stand yeah. on the hot pavement. I long. couldn't stand on the hot pavement, so they let me go to the front, which was nice because the line was like an hour long. <laughs> so I guess that's one of the benefits of losing your sandals. Welcome back. Just like that, we're all <laughs> showered and ready to go for Woo! dinner. You guys, what is screaming more? Oh yeah. Blue vibe, white, white and bright yellow. <laughs> I like this shirt a lot. I'll wear this I love back it. Home. I love it. I love it. <laughs> what I love even more is this view. Hello. Oh God, the sun is just setting. We are out. leaving again. There is land back here that you can kind of see. I'll never let go. So pretty. I know. Speaking of pretty, I am pretty hungry, and the menu tonight looks pretty awesome. <laughs> I know you like speaking of pretty. Look at Brittany. <laughs> I, I want to rewind that. <laughs> You are pretty, we already know that. Well, that is just funny. Given. He usually says stuff like that, so I was expecting <laughs> One other question we get, there is something called main dining. So we have a reservation every night at eight o'clock, yep. same waiter, same place in the main fancy dining room. Ooh. And it's all included within the cruise too. <laughs> just a tip, make yes. sure you reserve it when you book your cruise because it fills up. Yeah, it fills up fast. <laughs> So you guys, this is the main dining room. It's very fancy as you can tell. That You have like formal place settings, napkins. There's a dinner menu every night you can choose from, which is awesome. This <laughs> we is have one of our amazing waiters. the best waiter Thank ever, <laughs> Rakesh. He's awesome, you guys. So we are so excited. But yeah, this is kind of the experience oh, here. Absolutely incredible in here. Like everything's just like so, like look at all this stuff. I don't even know what to do with that. Yeah, there's so many forks and spoons. Uh, Yes, one of these is for your cereal. Stop. Then you have your soup. This is for your oh watermelon gosh. and squash. But it makes it all part of the experience. I wish I had a menu. We have it on our phone on the Royal Caribbean app, yeah. the menu, and it changes every day. There's oh appetizers, a main, and a dessert you get to choose from. And you get to choose however much you want of it as yeah. well, too. You can have as much as you want. And it's all included. So, anyways, this is really, I feel like, a special part of the cruise, this type and of dining lobster experience. Is coming up, baby. Yes, one night they do lobster tells you guys, that's all included, too. Here's the appetizers you get to choose from. So many entrees. On certain nights you can pay for other things too, but then one night, as we said, this is free. And then desserts you get to choose from the desserts. Oh, it's so fun. And then it's like through each day is scheduled out. All right, so for appetizers tonight, they have these sweet pork tacos in like the buns that look so good. These look amazing. Look at this bun. Look at that. Oh wow. my goodness. Right for appetizer two, we got the Greek salad. How good does that look? I'm going to be using one of my mini forks for this. <laughs> All right, for my entree, I got the tiger shrimp with like this delicious looking salsa and rice. That does look good. I got look a rack Jared. of lamb. Rack of lamb. Ooh. He's been waiting for that. He's been watching the menu and he waited for that to come up. That looks so awesome, babe. Be... <laughs> All right, we ordered another entree. This is the chicken cordon bleu with fries. And the shrimp were so good, we ordered another order of those. Oh, yeah. And Jared clearly really likes the rack of lamb. <laughs> so good. So, for dessert, we got this the first day. It was delicious. And we we're getting in again. <laughs> Oh, oh thank you. Apple all mode. It's like apple warm apple pie with ice cream. That looks good. I've gotten it every day that I could get it. <laughs> so good. We're on the front. 
awesome. Look how cool it is, all, all the lights and everything. And the statue behind me is epic. I mean, look at the size of that thing. It's like the heart of this shit. They have light music, dancing going on. It's incredible. And guess what, guys? I got shoes. We got his shoes. Heck yeah. <laughs> you guys, dinner was amazing. Oh, it was so good. Into our room, it's our favorite time of night. Look Penny's the best. Sweet Penny. We just love her. Penny. She you even outdid yourself this time. Put on little eyes. Are you kidding me? Like, look at this. Oh She's my good. gosh. It even has a yeah. She is good. That look at is that. So Penny. Cute. We love you. Speaking of Penny, we actually ended up giving her the vanilla. She loved it, you guys. I am so excited that we we're able to give it to her. She is the absolute sweetest, you guys. We love the entire staff that has yeah. been helping us. They're awesome. They're just so sweet. They like make the experience the experience yeah. on the cruise. Yeah, so, they're such a great, amazing people. Top notch. I think we're gonna go out on our balcony. Yes. Wind down the night, you guys. Today was incredible. From from start to finish. Even with shoes that got swept into the sea, you know, shoeless McGee over here walking around half of Cozumel <laughs> without shoes on. I really did. Also, we got a little bit of sun today, you yeah. might be able to tell. So we're hitting the sack, and tomorrow we're gonna be in Roatan, Honduras. Honduras, you guys, so make sure you come back. We love you all so much. Thank you for cruising with us, and we'll see you all tomorrow. See you guys, love you. bye. <laughs>channel today i had a little video with this in the background look how epic that is that you guys is roatan honduras and we are watching it right now as the sun rises over the ocean earlier it actually rose over roatan itself it was the coolest thing in the world but look how beautiful this looks. This view with the sound of the ocean is just absolutely incredible. We've been researching it like crazy. Apparently it has really beautiful crystal clear water. We cannot wait to go explore it today. It's so cool. There's actually two cruise ships out there. Waiting to dock it looks like. There's one over here and then there's one right there. Man, this is like my favorite thing in the world is to watch ourselves pull up into port. And to add on to that with the sunrise this morning, this is just absolutely incredible. I mean, look at that view. That is insane. Oh my goodness. And in case you're wondering where Brittany is, she actually just off her shower real quick. But guys, we are so stoked to go explore today. It's going to be so much fun. Hey guys, we have almost officially pulled up into Roatan. This is so breathtakingly beautiful. If you guys have the opportunity to come on a cruise, definitely wake up early. You guys arrive to a destination because it is so worth it. Looks like we already have another cruise ship. That was the one that you guys saw from earlier. already opened up the vlog. We watched the sunrise this morning come up over Roton and it was breathtaking. Like so suddenly beautiful. We tried to capture it for you guys so hopefully you guys love that. Now we are getting really close to port. As Jared mentioned, this is the Norwegian Breakway. Look how cool it is. I love that we can get so close up to other cruise ships. It's just so much fun to see. I am curious, we've never been on Norwegian. If you have, let us know how you like it. We are definitely thinking about trying it out. See how it compares to Royal Caribbean. But I gotta show you, look at the cute little port side we're pulling up to. I love the bright colored buildings. The mountains here in Roton are so pretty. There's a little mist going through all the valleys right now. Oh, it's gonna be awesome. So this is Jared's favorite thing to do, he said, is to watch the ship come and dock. So as you can see, I think we're gonna be docking right there. Is that right, Jer? Yep. So it takes a while, because obviously the ship is huge. So the reason why this is so dear to me is because I learned how to do this from my dad. Aww. When we went on cruises together with my family, 
and he and my mom loved waking up every morning to watch us pull and pour, which was the coolest thing in the world. They passed that off onto us, obviously, but I remember watching it with my dad up on the balcony, which was really cool. That is so cool. Yeah. I can just hear him explaining exactly how all this know. works. He knows know. all the right things to this to me. about Marina's dogs, yeah, how it knows. all works. He knows everything. I know he's just smiling down on us right now. So excited for us to get to experience this. Oh my goodness. Just like that, we're in Roatan, baby. Yeah. Woo. Look how colorful this is. This is the cruise port of Roatan. This thing is awesome. It's so cool. It is so cool. cool. so happening. Lots of shops. You can get off. It's early in the morning. There's live music going. Oh it's my really gosh. Fun. I love it here. Oh my goodness. Wow, beautiful. Look at this. Looks like there's a shopping center over here. Everything is awesome. This is beautiful. You could just spend the day walking around here. Oh, you really could. So I think the plan is to go to a place called West Bay. From there, we're going to try to do some snorkeling. But it does require a taxi ride to get there. I asked them if we could take a water taxi. They said they are booked up. Uh, trying to decide whether to go to West Bay or Half Moon Bay. They're different sides of the island, and we decided on West Bay. One other fun thing we learned about this port is there's actually something called the magical chairlift. It's pretty much like a little chairlift that takes you over to the beach that's close by, which is really cool. I've heard it's about 15 minutes long. You're about 70 feet up in the air. So we may need to do that if we have time. We have heard there's not the best snorkeling over that beach and that's really what we want to do. So Derek just found a place that will actually drive us over to West Bay. And then from there, a boat will be waiting and they'll take us out for an hour snorkel. Here in Rotan, there is a ton to do. There's zip lining, sloth tours, snorkeling beaches, you name it, shopping. We have decided we want to go snorkeling, check out the reef. Yes. Supposedly it's the second biggest reef in the world next to the Great Barrier Reef out here. And apparently it's supposed to be some of the best snorkeling in the world. Yes, so yeah. fingers crossed we will see. So we're going to head to do that. Like I said, I think the chairlift is right over here and it takes you up over these little hills uh, over to the beach. So if we get back in time and we have enough time, that would be kind of cool. Yeah, that'd be do. dope. I think it's around $20 a person to do that. Our taxi just dropped us off to West End Beach, which is a really cute beach town here. We are now jumping on to a boat to go Hopefully out snorkeling to over to West to Bay. Guys, this is <laughs> awesome. This is like Bogus del Toro, Panama. Yes, it feels a lot like <laughs> Panama. It is absolutely beautiful. Oh my gosh, guys. This oh my is gosh. so cool. I, I wish we had longer time to go like explore all the cute shops and everything, but this is gonna be awesome. Yeah, this is gonna be sick. about to go jump inside these waters right here and do some snorkeling. Holy cow, you Look guys. how Brittany's swimsuit purposely matches this boat. We okay. looked far and wide for a boat that would match her swimsuit. We found it. <laughs> yeah, we did not plan that at all. We didn't plan it at all. It's kind of funny. It's the same color blue. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, guys. It's this amazing. is going to be insanely epic. We got Jose. He's our captain. He's, He's a, a total captain, stud. Jose. We've been chatting with him, he's super nice. This is actually his boat, his company, so if you guys ever come to Roatan, you gotta go check out. Jose. 
Passe. Yeah. Passe. Yeah. What's you. Like that, we're back, baby. You guys, oh my was gosh, mind blowing! That like, was amazing. The reef here is so beautiful. The reef is beautiful. <laughs> I was just telling her, Jared, that was, this was a better reef than the Great Barrier Reef. Yeah, in Australia. oh, by far, no question. Like, so, we went to the Great Barrier Reef in Australia. That was amazing. It was very, very beautiful. But this definitely this, takes the cake. It was beautiful. It yes. was so colorful, so lively, huge, like. Dips and hills and valleys and everything. Yeah, like the really cool valleys <laughs> that you can see way down in the ocean, yeah, the coral, so cool. everything. And the fact that it was just the two of us, yes. our guide came out oh, there with us. He found yeah. that conch shell, which was yeah, really cool. He that was that awesome. before he put it back. That was seriously so oh my cool. Oh gosh. So you guys, we are so glad that it worked out because we were getting a little nervous when we first yeah. got off. It's a little overwhelming when you uh -huh. get off the ship. We did see some of the big tours out there on the catamaran. Probably over a hundred people smashed Oh, easily, together. easily. And you guys, most of those on the ship were probably at least, what, babe, 70 bucks? 70 yes. to a hundred dollars? Yes. For the same thing we just did privately. <laughs> privately, exactly. On our little boat that we found. <laughs> just one of the vendors. That matched Brittany's outside. swimsuit perfectly. <laughs> one of the vendors we found outside of the cruise port, you guys, so $55 per person included the transportation to get here, the boat ride, and it's gonna be the transportation back. But there's one thing we learned, doing the excursions outside of the cruise port are cheaper than booking them through the cruise. Now I will say, if you are a planner and you don't wanna worry about yeah. actually not things yeah. working out, go Definitely don't do cruise. what we did then. Go through the cruise by all means, yeah, you'll have course. an awesome yep. time yep. too, yep. but. Oh my gosh, absolutely. this place is so beautiful, look at this. This reminds me a lot of like Bacimentos, Focus del Toro, Panama. You guys have yeah. seen vlogs when Brittany and I went there, but Oh my gosh, like this is insanely beautiful. Got to West Bay and we were eating at this amazing little restaurant here. It's called Argentinian Bay here at West Bay. Grill. Grill, never mind. Oh my gosh, look at this. Our driver brought us here, so there's a fifteen dollar entrance fee, but you have this little private beach. You get chairs. all the water's unreal. Yeah, we got our own private chairs covered. We can use the kayaks and stuff. And this restaurant is so cute, and the food looks amazing. Yeah, it really does look amazing. We got. Classic drink. Oh, this isn't glasses. Fanta right here. This is tropical. This oh, is a tropical. Honduras drink. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I asked I asked him what's a good Honduras drink and she said tropical. It's it's banana flavored. Oh my gosh. Well let's you know how it is. That's <laughs> Heck yeah, I'm gonna pour it in right now. Ooh, yeah. I love how cold it is. It's like ice. Nice and slushy. Jared's first taste. Mmm. How is it? Is it good? That is so good. Banana? It's really good. I gotta awesome. taste it. <laughs> what do you think? Oh wow. It's like candy. It's 
<laughs> very sweet. Yeah. Very sweet. Very, it's so very good. Sweet, good. <laughs> okay, guys, our food just got here. Holy cow, it looks so good. There are flies around. <laughs> I got this shrimp skewers, fries, plantains. Oh, oh my baby, God. that That's looks good. good. And then I got myself the West Bay Burger, is what they call it. It's got bacon, cheese, guacamole. That looks good. Comes with fries. We're gonna dig into this and then go hit the water. Hey guys, we just got to West Bay. This place is insane. Look how crystal clear the waters are. The beach? I it's mean, perfect. are you kidding right me? Here. Look at the fish. Literally fish right there in front of us. It is beautiful. So Why as you can beaches? see, it is a very popular beach. Yeah, very popular. The place we ate at was right here, and then these are the little chairs you can reserve, 15 bucks. Down there, it looks like a ton of these similar places all along here. Oh my gosh, this place is just like pure heaven. Pure it's heaven. amazing. And the water, oh yeah, my cool goodness. This is. this is amazing. Wow. <laughs> Such soft, white, powdery sand. Yeah, the sand is so soft and there's like no seaweed, anything like that. Oh, this is just such a cool vibe. I love the vibe out here. you can choose from West End, West Bay. This is West Bay right here. So we did both. We did West End and West Bay. Yeah. This is definitely cooler. Taxi took us to West End. We did our snorkeling. It was yeah. amazing. And yeah. then they brought us here to West Bay. places you can stay oh my gosh incredible well, you're just saying we really think this is the nicest beach we've ever oh, been by to. by far this is the most beautiful beach i have ever been to i mean the west sunday islands might actually compare with sundays yes this but is just incredible my I mean, gosh. you have to get you have to travel so far to just to get to but this and i feel amazing. like these palm trees and everything know, and the sand, trees, the sand oh the water just Look how everything. crystal clear this water is it is beautiful i could spend a week here easy <laughs> look at this i, wish more time in this I know i, I really, really wish we had do. more time here <laughs> i can't get over it it's like super basket already. <laughs> yeah, I said I wouldn't eat bread, but it's so dang good. We always say that, but we do. <laughs> Anyways, we will show you what we ordered for tonight. Alright guys, we got a seafood cake here to share. Not really sure what it's made out of. Maybe seafood. <laughs> Brick got a arugula salad, is that right? Yeah, with pomegranate oh, and goat cheese. Yummy, yummy. So and for dinner, you guys, I got the short rib, I believe. It looks delicious. We got a mushroom risotto to share. Ooh. And Brittany got the. Uh, a white sole, I believe it's called. White sole. I have no idea. All right, that looks good too. <laughs> okay, a little fun fact, you guys. Ever since I've known Jared, at the end of every meal, where there is a cloth napkin. He makes this little shoe out of it, like yeah, that. Yeah. 
and leaves it on the table. Is that not so sweet? <laughs> we just came out to walk the boardwalk. We have not shown you guys this yet. So they have this really cute beach boardwalk. They have like games, carousel, hot dog stands. Yes, that's all included. Those are open during the day. Look how fun this is though. They have like a sugar shop. I know they have a, I think a Johnny Rockets maybe. An arcade. And then tonight we are going to a water show. You can see people starting to line up. They have a literal water show on the back of the boat with a diving pool and everything. So it's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be so cool. We'll try and capture some of that for all of you too. The show was incredible yeah. tonight. We tried to capture it yeah, from some of you. It was awesome. But literally the best show I think we've ever seen. Oh, hands down. And the funny thing is it's on the back of a cruise ship. Yes. Also, the food we ate, amazing. I don't think we've eaten anything that has tasted bad. Yeah, yeah. it was amazing. Everything from start to finish. Honduras was amazing. Yes. Such a cool island. If you ever get the chance, make sure you go to it. It was incredible. Tomorrow we're going to Costa Maya, yeah. Mexico, guys. It's our last cruise port oh, destination. Last it's a little port. sad. But we still have a few more days left. Yes. So if you're new here, make sure you subscribe and we'll see you all tomorrow. See you guys. Love you. Bye. Bye. pulled up on our boat. Check out the size oh, of this thing. thing right there. Garrett just said boat. So many people are correct and <laughs> saying no, it's a ship. It is. It's a cruise ship and that's a massive one at that. Look at the size of that thing. We are so excited for this morning. We're actually in a little bit of a rush today. We do have a reservation today. Heck yeah, baby. We planned something so incredible we cannot wait to share. We need to walk all the way down the pier though into Costa Maya. So we'll see when we get there. Yeah. <laughs> it's a beautiful sign. Check that and out. Background. I know this background's unbelievable. This, so this town right here, this like little village, is so pretty. It's so picturesque over there. I mean, just look at that setting. That is insane. There's actually a pool right here with a pool bar, literally right up against the ocean. The ocean's actually spilling into the pool, which is even cooler. So from what we've been told, Costa Maya is a little more rural, a little more undeveloped. Today we are doing a dolphin encounter. Swim. <laughs> Heck yeah, baby! Like We've never done anything like this before. We are so excited. <laughs> I'm a little nervous. <laughs> I've never been close to a dolphin. I know. I'm a little bit nervous too. So we booked this right through Royal Caribbean. So it'll be really interesting to see how the tour goes today compared to like what we did yesterday. Yes. We did the tour alone. So 
we'll kind of see and we'll let you guys know our thoughts on that. But this town, I mean, it's beautiful. Oh my gosh, look at that. Even like the mural right behind you, it's just so epic, so beautiful. So there are quite a few different things we could choose from to do, but we decided to do dolphins because we've never done that before. There's snorkeling, there's like a river tour, there's Mayan ruins you can go take a look at. So we need to jump in line right here and we'll see you with the dolphins. We just finished up with the coolest thing in the world. Oh my gosh, you guys. So we did the dolphin swim and sadly we were not allowed to take yeah. it to the video cameras whatsoever. They're pretty explicit about that. You cannot film it in any way, shape, or form. But they did take our photos. We did get photos and we paid for those photos. We did pay for those photos. <laughs> but the photos were honestly so great. It's the only memory we had of the dolphin adventure and it was so awesome. Yeah, to be able to touch a dolphin <laughs> like that, it was crazy. It wasn't like, was even real. It was like almost like rubbery feeling. Yeah, the, it was yeah. a little squishy. I almost yeah. didn't want to hold on to it. I didn't want to hurt it at all, but oh my gosh, it was oh absolutely gosh. Incredible. Okay, so let's walk you through this from start to finish. So we signed up on the ship and we found out it was actually $10 cheaper per person on the ship than off of the ship, which yeah. was really nice. So there's a company here, Dolphin Encounter. When you come to this port, it's the only place that does it. It's literally right off of the cruise ship, as you can tell. Yeah. You literally just walk across on that little boardwalk, come over here, and you see all like these little hut things. It's right there. So they break you into smaller groups and you're with a trainer and you go down these stairs right here. Yeah. And then they pretty much just do a variety of different things. You put out your hand like this, the dolphin comes by, you touch it, which was really It was really cool. Yeah, they swim right past you, you can pet it. Yeah, you can pet it. And then they have you pose with it for photos different ways. And then we got to swim with it, which was Guys, how epic is that? So we got to go out into the middle of like this pond thing right here. And you put one hand over your heart and the other one like this. The dolphin literally comes, flips around onto its stomach. You grab its fins like this and you're like <laughs> laying on its tummy. It is the coolest and thing in the world. The other side. That was, that was my favorite one. That was my favorite one for sure. And then the second thing they do is that they put you on a boogie board. You put your feet out like super stiff and it pushes you. Pushes you for it and you just go for it like that. Oh it my was gosh. So cool. It was so cool. And then they have you do, like Brittany said, a bunch of different hand motions. You get the classic of the kiss on the cheek. We love that yes. one. And my favorite was actually holding the dolphin with one hand and then petting it. Jared with the got other. an awesome photo yeah, of the dolphin that was cool. smiling. He's holding it like <laughs> it was so cool. And it's really it's really cool to just see them interact with them. Yeah. They love coming up to the trainers. They like tickle them. They even let us pet them more. Like it was really, really cool. It was awesome. Now I will say it is pricey. I, yes. I think this is a one and done, one yes. in a lifetime thing. Of course, when we have kids, there were people with kids in the group and the kids' faces just <laughs> this again with kids. Yeah. For sure. That was really cool to see. But it's $125 per person. That's a lot. It is a lot, like I said. <laughs> However, we didn't spend a lot on excursions on this trip. Yeah. So yep. we felt okay doing that for this. And then here's where they get you the photos. <laughs> the photos are also very expensive. <laughs> yeah, so you can get three photos. They'll print them out for, I think it was $55. Yep. Or you get all of your photos, which we had 92. Yes. And you have, can have all of them high quality digitally for 150. Yes. Now let me just point this out real quick. It's $55 per person. Oh yes, yeah. sorry. So it would have been 110 total for just three photos. Yeah, so that's, yeah. that's definitely where they get you, but you better believe we were gonna get those photos. That's what <laughs> everyone does. Jared also asked the nicest guy to take some video from a phone. <laughs> yeah. 
but yeah it was really cool and he did it like a uh, portrait so it wasn't vlog format but maybe we'll throw that in here <laughs> Look how tall their legs are. Oh my gosh, it is beautiful. That is so cool. I think this is the coolest looking bird I've ever seen in real life. Oh my goodness. They look like statues. <gasps> They're beautiful. Oh my gosh. Not only do they have flamingos, they have parrots over there, they have swimming pools. Tons of shops, things to do. Of all the cruise ports I've ever been to, this is by far the coolest. Yeah, this is the coolest. Jared did find the drill and he said, really yeah. all he sees is just the stuff that's here at the port. Yeah, there's not a whole time. lot after this. It's kind of undeveloped. Yeah, so this is the place to just come yeah. hang out. You can find anything you want here pretty much, but this is really, really cool. Look at kneeling right now. That is so oh my gosh. crazy I've never seen that before. Look like, how it been sits. That that, that is, is so crazy. I cannot believe that. We just got the coolest thing ever, which Brittany claims is the best thing she's had this yet. This is the best thing I've had. It's a fresh <laughs> watermelon drink. Oh my gosh, I can have like 20 of these. We got it from like just like, like a local stand over here called like La Fruta. They have it was really I cool. Yeah. Oh. So good. Make sure you stop by. Very fresh. Some more vanilla, we might have to pick up. All the hardship is beautiful. This is a tortolito, no queda bien well guys, another port, another Time one down. Time to say adios to Costa Maya, Mexico. <laughs> Bye, look at Costa the water Maya. right now. I know, now. look at that water. It is like... Pristine, blue, turquoise. Wow, yeah. that looks unreal. That Seriously so cool. cool. A really fun cruise port. I was actually, I liked it a lot more than... Yeah, I think this is the first time we actually didn't go outside of the cruise port. Yeah. In any place we've ever been to. But I mean, you guys can kind of see, there's not really a whole lot around us. Like I said, I think there's some river tours, a few other things like that, ATV type stuff, horseback riding. But I, I, I honestly would just plan, if I were to come back here, yeah. I would just plan to stay right in here. Do exactly. Shopping, I think of all the places pools. we could have just stayed at the cruise port, is definitely this place this just port. because there's not a whole lot to do and it had the dolphin thing that we wanted to do that the other places did not have. And it was literally right there. We'll yeah. Walk like yeah. Minutes the Seriously. So, awesome, awesome day. Now it's time to get back to our beautiful ship. Just like that, we're formal, baby. It's formal, right, <laughs> you guys. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Look how good.
good my baby looks. Oh. Look how good my husband looks. I mean, are you kidding me right now? <laughs> She's a doll. You guys, oh. this is so fun to get a little bit dressed up. As you guys can tell, we're not like formal formal, but yeah. we're like classy formal. I, I wish this was formal formal. Check it out, I'm wearing a t-shirt. He's That's got his dope. black t-shirt on. He's got his, I just gotta show his outfit because he looks so sick and handsome. He's got his blazer, he's got his nice shoes, I mean. Yeah. Oh, look at that sunset oh. behind him. Oh yeah. Oh my goodness. Good, look at this, you guys. It is absolutely breathtaking out here. Yeah, I'd say the view is breathtaking. Oh. <laughs> I know a ton of you guys went shopping with us to look for formal attire. Do you want to know where I ended up finding this dress? Huh. Walmart. <laughs> That is right. I found this at Walmart. The best part is it's so comfy. It's like stretchy material right oh, here. Oh yeah, that is nice. And it has this really cute like, pattern on the yeah, sleeve. Yeah, like perforated, not perforated. I, love it. I think it's like ocean coastal. I love it. Oh. And with that sunset view, baby. Oh, oh, yeah. We are headed off to dinner tonight. Tonight is lobster night. And Heck we're yeah. So dang excited. Do you guys want to guess how many lobster tail Brittany ate last time on the cruise? <laughs> no, don't talk. <laughs> <laughs> you guys guess that below, we'll let you know. On our honeymoon, I ate <laughs> a she lot, beats it. guys. I ate a lot, I will tell you that much. Also, we just filmed a TikTok reel at sunset, Ooh. formal, so by the time you see this, hopefully it'll be up, I'll see when it's gonna post. The Wi-Fi on the Our Wi-Fi is a little hit in this, but make sure you keep checking out for that, because I think it's gonna be really special. I'm yeah. excited for this one. Got our first course. We got caprese salads, yeah. and then this is like a shrimp potato salad with citrus sauce, and it looks so good. That's my kind of potato salad. Yeah, that looks so good. And you can drown mine. We got the butter. Keep it going. Keep it going. <laughs> okay, guys, we got Edwin right here. He is the absolute best. Thank you. Thank Seriously, you. we have enjoyed our time with him so much. He's fun. a stud. He's, He's awesome. 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 We got the lobster. Oh my gosh, this smells amazing. This is the reason why you come on a cruise. Bon appetit, Jerry. <laughs> All right, babe. How many lobster tails did you have? I had three and a half. Three and a half. They you were so shared good. with me. They were so <laughs> sweet and brought us some. Honestly, this is like the best. Yeah. Speaking of bringing us stuff, hello. Check out this dessert. Dessert just came. So we got chocolate molten cake. We got an apple tart. Oh, that's one of our faves. I got a chocolate one, and then this is a pineapple upside down cake. Ooh. Oh my goodness. Well, dinner was amazing as always. You guys, dinner was so much fun, so good. We sit next to the most darling couple from oh. the Dominican Republic. They're awesome, seriously, we love them. They don't really speak English, <laughs> we don't speak Spanish. So we use like Google Translate yeah. a lot. And, and then, it's awesome. And then our nice waiter, Edwin, he'll always come over and yeah. talk like he'll translate. Like translate. So, that, yeah. so fun. <laughs> now we are coming out you, to the, the, the Royal Promenade. We got music going, you guys. The lights are on, and one of our cool things is this light feature right here that changes colors all the time. Just look how beautiful it lights up my baby. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you guys, you're just talking about what has been some of our favorite things during the cruise. There's been so many amazing oh, memories. Amazing, oh, yeah. For we can't sure. choose. We want to know what has been your favorite memory from the cruise. Yes, definitely let us know down below what and, you guys think. And just because we're saying doesn't mean the cruise is over. We still have one more full day. One yes. more, baby. Stay tuned. If you guys are not subscribed, hit that subscribe button right now. Down below. Okay, one part of the ship we have not shown you guys yet is the Royal Theater, and it's because they usually have plays and stuff in there, and we're so tired tonight. There's a comedy show tonight. Yeah. There's been a few other performances as well. But yeah, it's right in here. It's like this huge theater. I think we go check it out, yeah? All right, guys, we're at a show. Jared is participating up here. Oh, boy, we don't know what's to come.
are the champions. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Jared just Gold medal, baby. a game. We walked in and they were playing Battle of the Sexes. Guys versus girls. Oh, and who won? Jared did awesome. He got a gold medal. Was I so was like fun. crying, laughing so hard. And Jared kept like cheering on the audience, like getting everyone excited. It was, it was so a lot of fun. fun. It was a lot of fun. Oh my gosh, now we are in Central Park. Yeah. Look behind here. Like, I know. That's so is. beautiful. Holy we cow. We haven't been out here at night before and it's all lit yeah. up and beautiful. It is breathtaking so way. beautiful look at that look how beautiful that view is right there right here oh, right here. <laughs> this is awesome what a fun night my wife is a hottie <laughs> guys today was awesome from start to finish seriously could not have had a more beautiful perfect day look now we're, we're ending, ending it here Look how epic that is. We're ending it in Central Park, you guys. Yeah. You guys, make sure you smash the like button if you have had fun cruising with us up to this point. And Heck make yeah. sure you come back tomorrow. We have another full day on the ship. There's so much more to show you. Yes. We are going to make the most of it. We're going to do zip lining. We're going to do the flow rider. We're going to do everything. In fact, one of you guys actually reached out to us and said, his name was Brian, by the way. So, Brian, thank you for this. He said, instead of smash that like button, smash that life button. Oh, I love that. <laughs> I love that. I love that. That's awesome. That's so cool. You guys, we absolutely love all of you. Thanks so much for all the sweet comments and just the love. We're so glad you guys are enjoying these videos because we love sharing it with you. <laughs> so with that, you guys, that's going to do it for us and we'll see you later. Love Bye. ya. Bye. What's up, you guys? Good morning, you guys. Welcome back, our cruise family. Want to <laughs> check out our view? Boom. This what we are seeing this morning the bright blue ocean we got the wind in our hair well in my brain <laughs> we are loving this balcony seat you guys it is oh so nice oh my gosh this <laughs> is literally a game changer one thing we have not even showed you so these chairs are awesome there's a cute little footstool here Ooh. but they also but that's not all. <laughs> yeah, you can you can totally lay out right here, which is really cool. Now, some of you guys may be thinking, well, it's shaded. How are you actually gonna get any sun? You'd be surprised how much sun we actually get right here. The sun, when the boat's in the right <laughs> spot, it shines right here, and it's beautiful thing it really oh is it's God. so nice right now it's actually a little cloudy which is nice because it's a little bit more chill day which we really like today is the last day on the ship we're I so know. sad about that but we're not gonna get sad yet today means we have a full day here on the ship to use all the amazing amenities funny thing is this morning we were literally just looking <laughs> at another Cruise. Yeah, <laughs> guys, we're addicted to these. They are so much fun, especially oh this balcony. Hello. I mean, <laughs> this has been amazing. It's been so fun reading your guys' comments. So many of you are like, you've never thought about going on a cruise until you watch some of these videos, which yes. I'm so happy about. That means we are conveying our true experience with you guys. I mean, which we love. We're not working with Royal Caribbean, which I wish we were. Yeah, if you have known anyone at Royal Caribbean, maybe put in a good word for oh, us. Oh yeah, hint hint. <laughs> but you guys. Guys, seriously, we are so happy you have enjoyed the vlogs. Jared and myself have had the time of our lives. Oh yeah. We cannot wait for today. I mean, <laughs> hello, it's paradise. So I think we're gonna wrap things up. Jared's just finishing up some things. Today's video going out, the internet's been a little bit slow. We're sorry about that. Yes. But then we are gonna go and hit outside. Are eating lunch. Heck yeah, we, just, baby. we decided to come to the Windjammer Buffet, which is included with the price of the cruise. This may not be a formal night. If you guys saw yesterday's vlog, go check it out. We not only was a formal night, but we also swam with dolphins in the ocean. In the ocean, and it was lobster night. Incredible dinner last night. But this food is still just as good. Oh, it's so good. They have like everything you can think of i mean yeah. this is just like a hodgepodge of everything board, yeah. yes but it's so fun i mean look at the view out here and then after this i think we we're gonna go up they have a taco place up by the pool deck we haven't tried yet now this is the most random play ever i had to go back for more noodles salmon this is a pineapple upside down cake this is a coconut lemon pie and then a coconut cake oh my goodness Back to the States. 
stateroom. Because it's Jared, cold out. <laughs> I it's need to put on my hoodie. It's chilly outside. <laughs> the sun kind of went away and the clouds are out and it's very windy up yes. on the pool deck. So we thought, you know what? Let's let our food digest for just a little bit. Yeah. Come grab a hoodie. We're speaking of a hoodie. Oh yeah, you check guys, it out guys. Have any of you guys gotten your swag that you've ordered? Most orders have gone out now. So I'm curious, let us know if you've gotten it, how you like it, and if you haven't, Make sure you go check out jaredandbrick.com. I know, a lot of you guys have been website. asking us about these and if they're available, yes, they are available. And the number one product still is this phone the case. The phone case. I think it goes pretty well. So awesome. Also, I want to know if any of you guys got the beach towel. That's one of my personal faves. But I thought while we were in the room, maybe I would show you around a little bit. I know we did a really quick room tour yeah. when we first got on the ship, but I wanted to show you kind of how I have unpacked and kind of how we keep everything organized in our room. So maybe let's start with this area. So it's really nice when you walk in, we have a little desk here. Jared uses this every day to edit. Heck yeah, which Slides is great. Right out, I sit down, I do my editing, <laughs> put it right back in. He's even got his nice little colognes here. I got yeah. my perfume. And then this area, we really like to try and just keep, we have our sunglasses here. They just brought over our bag tags, which sad day, that means the <laughs> cruise is coming to an end. We always keep like our little drink cups here, lotion, kind of stuff we'll need from time to time. What has saved us is because this would be all cluttered if we did not have our little magnetic hooks that we talked about from Amazon. If you guys have not seen our packing haul video, I have links to all these things we're showing really you. really strong, I'm actually trying to get it Oh yeah, up. they're super strong. I think the ones we got hold up to 25 pounds, but I know there's yeah. ones for 50 pounds too. So really fun, we hang our hats, obviously bags, purses, things like that. Sometimes I'll put our beach bag here. I do keep our beach bag outside as soon as like to shake off all the sand and things like that. And then we have drawers in here. These were Jared's drawers. He stored yep. everything. There's a fridge in there. And then I, I'll show you my closet. Ooh. So look how nice everything ah. fits in here. They provide hangers. So I hung up all my like nicer shirts and dresses and things like that. And then I have like my shorts, hat. There's a safe, which is great. I have all my t-shirts and tank tops rolled. And then this is where I put like all of our bags, all the things I pack, like this is our medicine bag. I have pool clips, just random things that are in bags. This is a nice little area for that. Then I have like swimsuits and stuff in here. And then this bottom drawer, I keep all my shoes, which many of you have asked for links for things. So we actually do have links for these water shoes from Amazon on our packing video. These are from Walmart, $15, some of my favorite new finds. Nikes and then these ones I'm wearing right now are also from Walmart. Also a lot of you guys have asked about some of the swimsuits I've been wearing. So the one I wore She's been looking so good, over right? <laughs> Bound over to in Walmart. Roatan. The one I wore over in Roatan, the bright black and green and blue one is from Walmart. Yeah. I love that one. It has like the high-waisted shorts. It looks good. It looks yes. really good. That's one of my favorite. And then the one piece that's really bright and like block swimsuit. Awesome. I did, I did find a link for that on Amazon. So head on over to Instagram. I saved it under Brit's face. So that's linked I'm there. I'm thinking that for the JV swag, you may have to be copying some of these. You may have to do another Experiment swimsuit. Experiment a little bit more with the swimsuits. I mean, we do live in Florida. <laughs> <laughs> and then my other one I get asked about a lot is is the pink and yellow top one, the one piece with the cutout right here, and that is from Target. So there you go, <laughs> hopefully that's helpful for any of you. But other than that, we keep a lot of our stuff outside drying, which is so nice. We don't have to have like wet that's clothes like and stuff in here. That's the best thing about having a balcony is that you have a little bit more space, and when it comes to a cruise ship, that's a big deal. Yeah. But then you can also like leave your stuff out to dry rather than have it sit in here and just be stinky. Yes, it's been awesome. And really quick, one more thing. So with the bathroom, I talked about this in our packing haul too, but my nice little hanging makeup organizer has been a game changer. We'll put a link for this as well, just from Amazon can fit so much stuff in here. As you can see, it's see-through, so I can see everything. I even put my jewelry in here. This has been awesome. You guys, it looks like we're headed into a bit of a storm. It's pretty windy. I need to stay away from the balcony. The boat is definitely rocking. Quite a few have asked, do you feel the ship ever rock? And we haven't a ton this week up until today. Today, we kind of woke up to it swing a little bit now you guys know oh it's like rocking back and forth it's rocking a little <laughs> bit right now which that tells you how windy it is outside because this thing is massive <laughs> but i have not gotten seasick at all you guys know i 
do get seasick when I go on smaller boats, but luckily I have not had any issue with that. This isn't like a massive, massive storm as of now, so we will see if it gets worse or not, but it's kind of, I mean, it's a little crazy out here, especially with the storm coming in. It hopefully it doesn't get any worse because that could be a little bit scary. Just like that, we're outside. You guys, we took a little nap this afternoon. And it felt like heaven. It did feel like heaven. The boat was so rocky though. I yeah, haven't oh my gosh. The ship was so rocky though. I have not experienced that on a ship before. I mean, you can probably tell like how windy it is. It's kind of died down recently, but before it was so windy. The whole boat was rocking back and forth. Like when he says, ocean had tons of white caps everywhere. Mist coming off of the waves. Yeah. It was bad. It was kind of yeah, it was a little intense there for a second. But it made for good nappy conditions. Yeah, it wasn't nice for that. We took a little bit of a rest and now we are back outside. I feel like we're kind of through it. I mean, it's still super windy up yeah. here. One of the things that we want to check out was this slide. It's like one of the famous slides here. You walk up into its mouth and then the outside on the tail, there are two slides that go all the way down and you ride this like carpet. It's like a carpet ride. And then there are actually two flow riders, one right here and one over on that side of the ship, which is a lot of fun. fun that I was yelling <laughs> and I got down the guy's like are you okay did you get hurt stop <laughs> like, no, I'm just, enjoying myself. just pure excitement <laughs> he's like did you get hit on something like on the side I was like no that's fun <laughs> that's so funny look how awesome it goes oh all God. the way down to there back there is the aqua theater where we went to the show the other night if you guys missed that make sure you go back and watch it the best show we've yeah. ever oh seen oh my gosh it was so cool it was so much fun Incredible, yeah. incredible, incredible. So you guys, we're in the sugar shop and they have pretty much every candy you can think of. Now this is for purchase. It doesn't come included, sadly, or else we would be here every day. Jared's getting some ice cream. Ooh, what oh, kind yeah. did you get? Sea salt and caramel. Sea salt and caramel. We got a spoon for me. Thank oh, you. Guys, I was trying to convince Jared to go on the carousel. <laughs> but he said no. I said I got ice cream. He got ice cream, and it's very good ice cream. It's a, what was it? Sea, sea salt and caramel. Sea salt and caramel. Wow. Very, very good. So we're gonna go find a little spot to post up. It's just so fun out here right now. Yeah, the whole really vibe nice. of everything. It's awesome. So this is the theater we were telling you about. This is where they do all the jumping into the pool. They have these really big TV screens. They even do outdoor movies here. I love they have chairs kind of all around the balconies that you can just take in the views too. I will say the movies that they did show we had already seen. So. Yeah. It's our last dinner. <laughs> no! I want to stay. Maybe I can just hide in there somewhere. Wouldn't yeah, that be awesome? Oh my gosh, I wonder if there's a YouTube video on that, like someone who hid on a cruise. Oh my God, that could be a good are. video. Just saying. Now we were ready to go have our last dinner. I'm more sad to say bye to the crew I know. and to the sweet couple staying next to us than anything. We've become like friends with them. I know. That's one thing with the cruise, you guys, we'll is that you legitimately become like friends with these people, yeah. like family. All right, you guys, for our last dinner, our appetizers came. We got crispy coconut shrimp. I had to go out in style, Florida. <laughs> we don't get enough coconut shrimp back home. We had to go out. We just got our main course. Look at what Jerry got. Lamb shake. Lamb shake. That looks so good. I got classic. 
fish and chips. Looks so good. For my last dessert, I got a berry pavlova. That looks so good. And I got the better option of the apple blossom. <laughs> We've caught that every single time we've come to dinner, at least once. There are, it's our so favorite. good. It has like the sugar crystal crust mm, on it. With sugar ice free, cream. all protein, zero calories. Yeah, so good. Jerry made his last shoe of the trip. That's right. So sad, but it's been amazing. We amazing, love these amazing. Guys. I know. These two right here. Could not. We're cashing Edwin. We're cashing Edwin. They're, They're the, the best. best. Request them if you come. I know, you guys got to get them. That's the thing. They're the best. <laughs> oh my gosh, it is so windy right now. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, wow, look at your hair. <laughs> Just a little wind blowing. Okay. <laughs> Looking good, baby. Looking good. Dinner was delicious. <laughs> <laughs> now we are outside on top of the Yeah. Because we have not shown you out here at night yet. And look at it all lit oh up. Oh my gosh. This is like the perfect time to come because it's all lit up. It's all beautiful. It's windy. It so is it's very empty. windy. <laughs> I know there's like no yeah, one up here. There's no one up here because it's so windy. But that's okay. That is not stopping us from yeah. coming up here, soaking it all in. Oh, we can't last night. Guys, this trip has been amazing from start to finish. Just thinking of all the places we've been to. We went to the Bahamas, we went to Cozumel, we went to Roatan, we went to Costa Maya. We did amazing things at every single one of those destinations. And then the time just here on the ship itself yeah. has been incredible. The crew that we've had to work with. Oh my gosh, the They've best. been incredible. Stateroom lady, Penny, she's oh, amazing. She's amazing. Then we have our waiters, Rakesh and Edwin. They, they are incredible. awesome, you guys. <laughs> oh, we're gonna miss them I know. so much. I know. Even though the trip feels like it's over over is not over over because we still have tomorrow. We still, we have, still breakfast. have tomorrow. We're hanging we're on. We're sneaking on the ship, Royal Caribbean. <laughs> That's right. We're not getting off. Remember? We're hiding we're, in the chimney. We're going to hide <laughs> in the ship. They're not going to be able to find us. I'm getting my snorkel gear and just going underneath the water. <laughs> this we will promise you guys. We will be going yes, on another cruise I know. very oh, soon. Very because soon. Because this has been incredible. We're yeah. so happy you guys have enjoyed these videos. If you've missed any of the videos, make sure you go back and yes. watch them. Seriously. Yes. The best memories were made this oh, week with hands this down, guy right here. Hands down. He is. I, I love, love you. It. Happy anniversary. Happy anniversary. You guys, we love you and we'll see you all tomorrow. And we get to see Finn. Yeah. See you, see you guys. Love you. Love Bye. you. Bye. It's I'm gloomy. To come out it's me. foggy. Oh man. It's everything bad. It's <laughs> coming to an end. Why? Oh, Why? My gosh, we are so bummed. Jared is Mr. Bright Sunny Cruise. I'm taking the cruise home with me. We ain't never leaving. And I'm gloomy all in black. <laughs> <laughs> we have had such an incredible time oh my on gosh, this it was cruise awesome. ship. Seriously amazing from Literally, start to finish. The, Loved it. The time of our lives. Yeah. So many amazing mm -hmm. memories made. We know you I'm guys. hiding in the ship. <laughs> in yeah, the we gotta go find our hiding spot yeah. because we're not getting off. It's actually pretty early in the morning. We need to be off the ship by 8 a.m. sharp. How they do departures now is you have departure groups and it comes up on your TV. And yeah, so we super have to convenient. Wait. Yeah, so that way it's just not like thousands of people storming to the elevators yeah, to get out. Totally bottlenecking everything. Yeah, they have a really good process yeah, now. Yeah. Even though I don't like the <laughs> leaving part of the process. Where can we hide? I don't Where think anywhere. Hide? But we are back in Miami. You may see Miami right back there. That's a pretty epic I background. I know. That is an epic background. That's awesome. That is really cool. The good news is we are headed home, which Woo! is only 40 minutes away. And we're going to go see Finn. And we're going to go see our little Finn who we miss so much. You guys have missed seeing him, so we're going to finish getting packed up and then hit the road.
Bye room. Bye happiness. Bye heaven. <laughs> and they'll have it down here for you. But we found it's just easier just to bring it with us. We don't have to wait in lines or anything that way. So that's been really nice. Because if not, then you are in this room trying to find your luggage in this area, which is, I mean, they have it organized by number, which is really nice, but I'm glad we kept ours with us. to a warm place, like yeah. Florida. That's true. Like, yeah, that's true. That's pretty, that's, that's pretty awesome. I'll admit, that it actually is really cool that we're coming back to Florida. We still get to see the beach. We still get to see the ocean. That still is our little paradise. Very, very cool. There's just something so magical and special about being on that cruise ship. Being on, I mean, it's vacation, yeah, right? Vacation. vacation mode. Yeah. You guys saw it. It's awesome. Anyways, you might be wondering, where's little Finn? I know, we gotta go pick him up. So he's at Duke's house, so we gotta go pick him up. And I cannot wait just to squeeze him. I'm so excited. <laughs> okay, so we're in the elevator, about to go pick up Finn. We gotta talk slowly, because he can hear us. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh you, you guys, we are back with our little Finners and Mr. Duke. Yeah, what's up, dude? Uh, we told Carissa, Duke's mom, let us take Duke for a little bit, give you a break. She is honestly incredible, such a great neighbor and friend. We love her so oh, much. Yeah, she's awesome. Finn is always in the best hands with her. He has so much fun with Duke. They're like best <laughs> little friends. My gosh, they are so cute together. I think I'm gonna keep this outfit on oh, all yeah. day. Look how bright Jared is. We are gonna hang out with the pups. I do not want to even, Jared started to unpack a little bit. I said, let's wait a second. I'll start doing laundry and all of that. I will say those little laundry bags we took came in handy. Yes, You're I got genius. to keep all my clean work. clothes separate from the dirty clothes, so that'll be super nice nice to do. But for now, you guys, it feels good to be home and we're just gonna hang out with our little fitters. All right, it's been a little bit since we videoed. Vacation never ends, baby. Jared's still repping the shirt strong. <laughs> it's actually a little later at night now and we are on our way to a movie. Yeah, movie night. I am particularly very excited about. So as many of you guys know, I loved the show Downton Abbey. I've talked about this many times. The first yes. time I saw it was earlier this year. I had never seen it until then, but I had heard they were putting out a special movie and I think it's only just today, which we just so happened to be home. And I was like, Jared, can we go? <laughs> he said he would go with yes. me. Only because the place we're going to is a <laughs> dine-in movie theater. Yeah, it's an AMC dine-in movie theater. We've never been to one of those. So we spent a lot of time with little Finn. We all just took a nap, which was awesome. We went on a walk. Oh yeah, we had a ton of fun. And then we left him and Mr. Duke back at the house and we are gonna go have a little date night at the movies. Yeah, it was really good. It was good. 
and Jared didn't never really watch Downton Abbey, so he didn't really know what was going on for the yeah. first, what, like 10, 15 minutes. I will say that, if you guys have never seen Downton Abbey and you don't know what it's about, you'll be confused, because <laughs> they don't explain it. I explain <laughs> a few things to him, but it was really fun seeing all the characters and everything yeah, that was fun. But what's even better is we were back outside with our yeah. little dinners on a walk. Heck yeah, walk time. It's, it feels like it's been forever since we've been on one of our nighttime walks, I know. which I mean, it has been a week, but it feels so good, you guys, to be back home with him. We miss him so much when we're gone. I know. Also, a lot of you guys are starting to receive your swag items, yes. which is awesome. You're oh saying in gosh. photos to us about how much you guys love your stuff. Yeah, we had a really fun surprise. My brother yeah. Brett and his wife Maddie, little Brixie, they sent us a picture they ordered swag from us. <laughs> we had no idea. Yeah, so. we had no clue, which was really, really cool. It so. was so fun. They were like, we love it. They got the awesome Hawaii sweatshirt version yeah. for Brett, and then Maddie got one of the crew neck sweatshirts for girls. Anyway. And as you guys can see, it fits them super well. And not just them, so many of you guys have been tagging us, sending us their pictures, cool. giving us your yeah. feedback. Which thank you for the feedback. <laughs> thank you. This is our yes. first time ever doing something I know. like this. So that has been so much fun to come yeah. back to. Yeah. Also, you guys, we are planning on doing a cruise Q and A. Ooh. So I know we've talked about this one other time, but if you have any cruise questions, drop them down below, and we yeah. will try and get to all of them in a cruise Q and A, which I think will be really fun. Heck yeah. Speaking of cruise and swag and upcoming swag, we got upcoming swag coming up for Father's Day. Yes. And we have some limited edition stuff coming up as well. So you want to keep an eye out for that. It has been quite a long day. We are exhausted. I mean, all that fun, all those smiles. We are, I think, ready for bed tonight. <laughs> yes. Sleep in our own bed, which will yes, be really our nice. Own bed. I mean, we're definitely gonna miss waking up to that amazing. I know. Not but I will lie. say the cruise ship beds, they're not our bed. They're not our bed. <laughs> Nothing's your bed, right? Yeah, yeah, but they're very comfortable. They are very comfortable. So we're gonna go ahead, I think, and close out today's video. You guys, thank you so much for coming along with us on this cruise. It's been so much fun sharing all the memories. I know, it's been incredible. We were so excited to see how much of you guys loved our videos. Like yeah. it makes us want to go on another cruise. I know. Well, if you guys want us yeah, to, I, I mean. mean <laughs> in fact, we even discussed about possibly inviting one of you guys. I know. I I've seen quite a few comments saying we should do like a big cruise. Giveaway or something like a that. A giveaway yeah. slash cruise and all go on a cruise together. Yeah. Whoever wants to come like books it and go. I don't know. I think know. that could kind I of know. be I think, I think that could be really cool. You guys let us know, but cruises are definitely in season right now and they're becoming more and more popular. So you guys let us know. I just think that could be so much fun to hang out with all of you in yes. person on That'd a cruise. So I mean, cool. it doesn't oh get much gosh. better than that. Cruises are awesome, guys. Let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> just talking about it again. Look at this guy's face. Oh my gosh. Even though the cruises and it does not mean the fun is over. We no, have no. so much more coming up this week. As many of you guys know, in a week we are going back to Utah. So if you're <laughs> new here, make sure you subscribe and we will see you all tomorrow. See you guys, love you. Bye. Bye.